Hello, hello everyone. Welcome once again to Conan. Uh, yeah. Alright, so... We did a lot of work on the Great Hall last time. We put all these tables in. And we've got the fire. Ella put some horns on the table. We've got our animals around. These crafting benches are going to move. And we got a bunch of curtains in. As well as some floating curtains. Very fancy. Fancy floating curtains. <laughs> and uh, the other thing that we, were to, that we had uh, looked at last time was uh, putting in more of these banners. I, I like these. They look, these look cool. Uh, these, these tall ones, they're what? Three? Over three? They're about three blocks tall. Maybe slightly more than that. And it looks like the only way that we're going to find them, or, well, they do drop us loot, but is it is an option to go over to New Azagarth. Apparently there's one of these in there that you can interact with, and it'll teach you how to make them. Anyways, hello, Ella. Hello. So, Ella's here, I'm here, and it sounds like my father's going to be here. Uh, he's not here right now, but... I'm sure he'll uh, let us know whenever he uh, hops in. When he does, we'll have to give him a tour of yes, what we have done so far. Very much so. So, goals for today. We've got our tavern. It's looking pretty uh, bare bones. We've got our counters here. I'm good at still keeping these counters in. Uh, we've got plenty of other like counters as well. Like bar counters, but the issue with them is that they're not very uh, customizable. Oh, did you put both of these in, or was that me? Uh, I put the other one in. You, you put, put the, the other first one. In. I yeah. Is that why we're having them? I thought it looked really cool. I think mine was off center because I was just I didn't actually center it. I centered mine. I always just. So we got these Kinscourge statues, so now Ella's got copies of herself. <laughs> you think they look alike? Yeah, they definitely do. Your sword's a little bit off. I don't have the same sword. Okay, well, goals for today. We've got our tavern. Or our bar, or whatever you want to call it. We've got the above that area. <laughs> and I'll show you that right now. In the one that we partially started working on? We did partially start working on it, yes. Loving how it's turned it out. We got the, uh, we got the different deer and elk and antelope and moose. I think the table Actually, and the rug there aren't really any well elk too. here. It's just no. It's just moose and deer and antelope. Yeah, because we don't have two um, elk heads. Ah. Uh... So when we do, it'll go on the third wall. I see. Is the elk one, is the elk bigger than the antelope? It might be. I'll, I'll rearrange it after. It's looking pretty cozy in here. Just with the light from the fire and the light from the previous floor. I need a rug to go on the other side of the table. Yeah, I guess that's the kind of light we have without the campfire, huh? So that's just the light from the kitchen. Yeah. That's pretty good. And then the, the hearth really gives a bit of uh, warmth to it. So we've got... Probably gonna have three more of these tables in here. Yeah. And then... What were you talking about? Like games and such on the rest of it? We could well there is that big chess board that we could put off to the side. Hmm. That could either go here or it can go in the tower. And then you said there were chess pieces. There are. There are. These banners are probably being moved, right? I see that they are not fully in position? No, they're not fully in position. I don't... I just know I want one on each side. I don't know exactly how it's gonna go yet. Red Young. Well, that's not a uh, name I've heard in the channel before. Welcome, welcome. Glad to have you here. Hello. Uh, 
you're in luck today because it just so happens that we're going to be doing a full castle tour today. Um, once my father gets on and uh, everyone's here, we'll be doing a full castle tour. He'll be able to see everything that we've done so far. And then we'll be working on, yeah, the, the tavern, the bar, um, and yeah, the dining area above the tavern as well. And I'd like to really do something with this place as well. Um, it looks really cool, just the way that the, uh, uh, just the way that these fences are. And in the, in the, in the Kaitan style, or no, in the, no, not Kaitan, uh, yes, it is Kaitan. Uh, in the Kaitan style instead of the black ice. But, uh, father put this here a while ago. Uh... But yeah, I'd love to make this into, like, another one of those, um, another one of those areas that you just, maybe this is where you have your breakfasts, right? Like, you have your feasts in the main hall, and, like, and then you go to, a, like, a smaller room, and that's where you have your breakfasts. Yeah. I, I, get, I get what you're putting down. Yeah, yeah. alright, alright. Uh, we do have more of these banners. Before my father gets on, I'm going to run over to New Azigarth to learn how to make these, because I like these. I, I did a little bit of research before stream, and found out... Okay. Our options are... Like, I want to put these style of banners. We've got these style of banners. We've also got the... Ah, you, you use Stormglass. I personally like the uh, Kaitan for interior, and this castle was specifically meant to be black ice. Um, yeah, here. I'll, I'll give you a quick peek at the outside. This is what we got so far here. Ah, yes. Oh, that's great. You can see the... Uh, oh, that's so cool. You can see the shrine like that. That looks re I didn't realize. That, that is perfect. Wow, okay. It's not perfectly lined up from here, but, but if you look still... at it at a slight angle, it's like, wow, that, that, that's that's fancy. You, also, you are dying. Yeah, I this is my cold gear. I like the Kaitan stuff, because I really love the style of it, but it's not my cold gear. I have both cold and warm gear, thankfully. The reason why I suffer with this stuff is because uh, the light veneer set is... It just bugs me a little bit. Like, it looks good, but it's just, it's just a basic hide armor that hardly, like, shows a ton of skin, like, but it's supposed to be good for the cold. <laughs> like, if it was some cute armor that, like, oh, hey, this belongs in the cold. Or, hey, this is some cute armor that, sure, you can show skin because you're in the desert. But no, it's the cold gear that shows the skin. It's like, really? <laughs> Anyways, uh, that's that's a rant for another day. Um, Stormglass is very cool. I've seen it in... Uh, I've seen it in some other builds. It does look gorgeous. Uh, Black Ice is the way we went for this one. But... That's because it fit the region, really. Uh, so I want to go find more of these banners. So I'm actually going to go ahead and run to uh, our map room. On that note, I was wanting to mention there's the Heirs of the North banner, which is the one that we're looking at right here, and that's going to be found in New Asagarth. There's also a banner that I was considering that is called... Is it the Forgotten Realms? No. The Forgotten Ones? Forgot... No. Oh, yeah. Uh, I did another... I almost oh. did another show. Okay, what did you do in the library? Right here. It's almost done. Ooh. And looking then, great. Uh, Ella's slowly been working away at uh, some of the library decorations. Ah, there it is. It's our librarian. I mean, it's the Staff of the Triumvirate. <laughs> <laughs> and then I put the little incense up here because it's the only place it can go. It can't go on a shelf for some reason. Really? Yeah. Same with drinking horns. I can only fit it up here. I can't fit it anywhere else on the shelves. Which is really weird. Very well. But yeah, anyways, that's the library so far. I am 
Okay. Uh, give me a... Let me pause for one moment. Because I am going to go ahead and I am going to check a... Or check to see which thing that I was looking at earlier. Oh, yeah, the uh, wiki. The Forgotten Clan banner. That's what I was looking at. Where do you find it again? That one is specifically found at the Mounds of the Dead. Ah. Oh, we yes. should go to the Mounds of the Dead and find it then. It looks really cool. It does. I'm probably going to put a little bit of both in there. Some some heirs of the North and some... Uh, Forgotten Clan. Forgotten Clan. That's the one. I forgot. Okay. So, where are we going first? Mounds of the Dead or... No, let's go home first. I mean, by home, I mean our Yamatai castle. We'll find that over here. Because we have a teleporter at our Yamatai castle, it's better to go there. Uh, most of my bases... Uh are one big tower in the middle and six smaller ones around it to join by a bridge on level two. That sounds really epic. That sounds so cool. Uh, yeah. I had an idea where um, we did have like a, a, like a wall system and like we had a wall over a tower so you could go through the wall, uh, like inside the wall and over to the tower. Then I also had an idea about, like, having a special mage room, or mage tower, uh, that didn't actually have any doors, and the only way to get to it was, like, using a ice stair, or, an, like, the, the spell, um, to ice bridge or ice stair up to the tower. So that way, the mage's tower could only be entered by mages. Yeah, those are some of the ideas, but this is a build that um, we made a couple of years back. More than a couple. Quite a few years back, actually. And uh, it was originally on a server that was pretty active at the time, and I remember having a lot of fun with it. We made it specifically in that area, and specifically that shape and size, because that is the limit. Like, it's right beside the volcano, it's right beside the Frost Temple, but, uh, essentially, we saw that there was a build limit away from the volcano entrance, and there was a build limit, uh, by the Frost Temple, and we found a giant rock, or er, a giant outcropping there, and that's where we decided to build. And uh, so we had to build a very specific shape and a very specific orientation to actually get it to fit. Because without the build anywhere settings, uh, you can't really properly build there. So it, it, it's more like a we are trying to use that space, limiting ourselves to that space, but also utilizing it so that we would be able to well, it, it felt comfortable because, like, we'd be able to fit it into that one space and make the most of it. And it's turned into something much different. Uh, this is the Defari banner. We apparently have it right here. So. Oh, yeah. Anyways, I want to come back. If you find any cool artifacts that could be put on a shelf, let me know. And if we find any more of the different uh, types of banners. Or deer he or elk heads. Oh. Drink. I should drink water IRL too. That's a good idea. <laughs> I have 8 of 100. Yeah, that's, that's a good idea. Ah, water is so nice. Water, best drink, changed my mind. Underrated. Okay, uh, where's our water skins? There we are. 
So where are we supposed to find the Dakar? Uh, not Probably the... didn't need to drink that much water, because we've got lasting beasts here somewhere, I think, right? <laughs> there we go. I don't know. Let's just look around. I'll see if we can find it. I checked in there already. I'm pretty sure it'll be of the same type, Ella. So you gotta look for that flagpole-like banner. Sounds mysterious. Use. You can use it. It's interesting. Uh, you said you needed ivory at one point? I'll grab the ivory then. Uh, yeah, it's for the horns. Do you have a banner anywhere? Like, here? I haven't actually looked at where it is. It might not be directly in the camp, but we can have a look around. I'm going for a run, Ella. Let me see if we can find it. Very well, might be outside. I didn't bother looking up the direct location. Oh, hey, look! That looks like it. Found it! Ah, I'm getting attacked by a sorcerer. Uh, a sorcerer. Come on. Where? Ow. Where? Oh, Ow. That's not going to move. What? No world alchemist? Ah! No, I don't want sticky keys! Get out of here! <laughs> I forgot to put the healing Oh my god, part. that's a lot of people! I haven't even pressed E on the thing yet! Thank you. Where is my healing stuff? I need healing. I don't have very much healing. Yeah, Ella, I forgot to bring good healing stuff. Uh, did you get your banner? Knowledge? Yes, I did. Hyborian Slaver and Loin. That's new. Aha! I have more drink. I have more... <laughs> Hello. Uh, I only had one left. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Hi. I thought you were someone coming to attack me. You're full health now. You'd be fine. There we go, I got it now. I suppose I should grab the belts. That's the Elk King. We have that already. Hi, people. Do you have cool artifacts on you that I can steal? Alright, alright. That works. Oh, yeah, I managed to hit them. Uh, nope. Where's that Elk King thing? It's on the other guy. Oh, is that the... That's that, the big one we have in the, the middle move. already. Yeah. It's not an elk, it's a moose. It says Elk King Trophy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a moose, not an elk. <laughs> I was never into uh, the hobbies of hunting, but I had a family that did it enough that I should be able to know some of my animals. Hi. Oops. That's that's an elk. I got one. You know what's funny? What? Uh, all three of these people had a full, uh, full-sized elk. Oh yeah, look for chests as well. Did you actually get the full-sized elk, or did you grab the? Uh... Oh, grab the head. Head. Okay. Grab... <gasps> Hi, kitty. Um, I'm not here for you. Though. <laughs> Ah, welcome James. Welcome, welcome. Hello. I found another Elk King trophy. No. Dire Wolf trophy. I did grab one, just in case we wanted it somewhere. Honestly, I'll grab that one too. Just in case we want to put it anywhere? Yeah, just in case we find places that we want to 
to go. People with spears! So, James, uh, I hear that my father is supposed to uh, join us sometime today. So, uh, you're, you guys are in for a treat. Yeah. Ow. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. this guy have? Not much. Behind Jella. Uh, oh, there's a black bear on that one. <gasps> there's a black bear head on this one. You want to grab it? I want to see. Kind of want to see what it looks like. All right, I'll grab it. I think there was another bear that I left. Hmm. A about... normal bears are fine. This one specifically says black bear. I don't think I found a black bear. There's another bear. There's a deer. I got I got deer already. Okay, let's head over to I thought there were a Yeah, you found some people, huh? Um Ah, I, I suppose I should give you a little bit of, uh, background. This is Ella, this is my girlfriend. And, um, I, I refer to my father. Um, he's got his own channel. Um, he, he is Drake Hawkins, and his, uh, channel name is Clan Hawkins. And, uh, he's the one that originally got me into, uh, games and streaming, you know, as, as fathers seem to do. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, we we play games occasionally. Um, the three of us all play For the King 2 on Fridays as our Friday night uh, multiplayer stream. So, uh, we actually originally started playing all three together in Conan here as well, but uh, he ended up uh, wanting a wanting his Wednesdays as a uh, as a free day. So. Which is fair. It's <laughs> very busy. Yeah. So Ella and I moved on to uh, working on Castle and finding other things to do. Yeah. Um. Yeah, he's the streamer, not me. I'm, I'm just here for fun. <laughs> She's hardly a gamer yet. She's a new one. <laughs> it's only been a, a couple of years. You've played. No, it's Effectively three games. <laughs> a couple more here and there whenever I rope you into them. Yeah. What are those three games again? Well, I had the bad idea to... Uh, oh, it is our own server, yes. I had the bad idea to uh, introduce her to League pretty early on. Yeah, League was my very first game that I ever played, and that sounds really bad. It's something I played with the friends, so. Yeah. Hey, look. They have the little sign. See you? Look. Where? Where? Oh, you're here. Yeah. Oh, I don't have a weapon now. So where are we going to find their bear? Huh? Um. That's brimstone. That's you. Um, hey, if you're interested in joining the server, by all means, if, uh, if you want to, the link is, uh, with all the server info, it's in our description. Or, it's in our, not the description, sorry. It's in our Discord, which is in the description. Just head over to the Clan Multiplayer channel, um, and it should be pinned up there. I just found something. What'd you find? I don't know, it's some thing on the floor. It's a red mushroom. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of them here now. It looked like a water skin. I found at first. a hardened steel greatsword. It, 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 it was, was just on the furnace? Yeah. That's cool. It was just there. A uh, silver stone. Wait, hi. 
So I'm looking for this banner. Oh. Looking for the banner, yes. Um. I went to the central area because I figured that's mm -hmm. likely where I'll find the banner. Didn't they give you coordinates before? Yep. I decided not to look at the coordinates because I wanted to go a little bit, uh, do a little bit of exploring. Hello, father. Why are you yelling at me? Where are you? Oh. You're you way over there. Oh, jeez. Hey, we can learn the chicken dance. Huh. Die! Oh. Oh, hello. That person's cool. He's got star metal stuff and uh, mace, too. I want to see, but you keep running away. Oh, yeah, this guy? You picked the wrong fight! Uh, yeah, you can build on the server, just if you're going to be building a big base, just try to keep a little bit of distance between, uh, uh between, uh, yourself and our builds and such, but... And, well, there is one other build, but, uh, they went, in, they went inactive. Uh... Alright, Father will be on in a bit. Uh, yeah, as long as you're courtesy of others on the server and their constructions, then you're welcome and come on in. I wholeheartedly agree. Let's see. I'm looking for the rest of the place. Probably going to the other side to find it. Uh, Father, for context, we're... Uh, I'm not sure how long you've been here for, but we're looking for the other banners. There should be one over here. Somewhere. In the Mountains of the Desert. Wait, no, Mountains of the Dead? Not the Desert. I could use some help. Instead of you running away. I have no idea where you are. Oh, I'm you're over at the by entrance. that entrance. Yeah. Oh. Are you trying to kill everything? I'm trying to loot them. <laughs> That's why they're getting mad at you, huh? I don't have healing stuff. I don't have healing stuff! Like none? No, apparently I left it at home. Uh... I found a Forgotten Clan's tattoo. Okay, I still have my Roja on me. Um, you didn't find it, did you, yet? What's that? You didn't find the thingy yet? I have not found the thingy yet, no. Okay. Oh. I'm uh, trying to drop a portion of these. How about split? I have these, uh, less good ones. That will work. And... there you go. Oh, I better put those back in my inventory, or I will, or I will surely die. Okay, and Ella's back to fighting. Who's there? <laughs> All right. Okay. My issue is just that I have a slower attack speed. Ah. Uh, my heavy attacks are very slow. My light attacks are good, though. I mean. Fight quick. Let me find my sword. Where's my other sword? Hi, you. This way I can uh, have a torch out and see where I'm going. I can have a torch just by equipping a weapon. Yeah, she's got a light up sword. I found a Forgotten Clan's banner. A little child's toy over there. I found a banner. You found it? Oh, yes, just please loot the banners. Because every one of those banners is like, what, 25, 35 silk or something? Something like that? It's a Forgotten Clans banner. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's great. I was just saying, every banner you find is one that we don't have to uh, make. This is true. Where did you go again? Well, there's ghosts! I went to the oh, wait, left, the across the bridge. Ooh, just... um... I feel like it's 
going to be rather hard to find this banner. Because it's both dark and raining. I don't know if we can see your light. But where's the bridge to cross? Ah. Uh, is that a question for the father there, Brett? Uh, humankind. Humankind is, uh... I'm trying to remember what game that is. It's similar in genre to uh, Civilization games. From what I can remember. There's something yeah. moving out there. That looks like a trap. I don't want to be in here. Um, apparently there's some hotkey that is trying to swap my keyboard layout. I also have not found the banner quite yet. Where is this bridge you speak of? Oh, hello. Found you. Oh, watch out! Ah! That one's seen us, no hunter. That's a maimed person. He's only got a 4% spawn rate. Oh, oops. That's okay. He's too far away to be dragged. I didn't tell you to stop, so. Yeah, Dad and I have uh, played a bunch of uh, Humankind just on our own spare time together. It's quite a good game, I will admit. Remember, killing people is okay because then I can get more artifacts that I can use in my library. Okay, well, maybe we have to go look at the other spots. Or maybe the Cursed Ground? Sure. Yeah, you have to find it yet. See, you know what the best part of streaming is? What? Uh, when random people that uh, you don't know start coming and chatting with you, because it makes it so much more cozy. <laughs> yeah, it's nice meeting people. Well, Wait, where'd you go? I went down. Oh, there you are. Like, you can stream for yourself, but it's always nice to, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's always nice to have people around. <laughs> yeah, and uh, remember, <laughs> no. killing people is fine. Quote <laughs> by Ella. Yes. Exactly. Only if they have good artifacts. <laughs> That's great. Hey, killing people is fine. Killing bunnies is not. Oh, I see. So that's where she draws the line, huh? Yes. I wonder if this is the cursed mound, because uh, I'm seeing a lot of not alive things. I'm seeing a lot of you not hitting people. Ah, you live in Australia. Mm. I've got some. I've got a friend that has a bunch of friends in Australia, but I live in Canada. It's another I, elk. A nice place, Canada. Never been to Australia. Uh, I found a lotus. Ella wouldn't want to go to Australia because of, uh, scary creatures. Nope, you, you guys can keep your over... You guys can keep your scary animals and oversized spiders, thank you. Yeah, she doesn't like spiders. Nope. Uh, not at all. Ah! Hello. Okay, now here's the question. What time is it there, where you're living? That's what I want to know. <laughs> and more uh, more than that, what day is it? Are you guys... You guys are on the 21st already, right? I think. Uh, I still haven't found that banner. Uh, I guess I'll go have a look. I'm in the, the house. I'll have a look on the wiki. Let's see, where is the Forgotten Clan banner? Uh, 
Um, B11. Oh, hello, you are huge. Okay, B11 doesn't help very much. Nope. I found a big guy. I'm a big guy. Ow. Hey, uh, you don't I'm... exactly have a map either for it. I am literally in the middle and there is a huge boss. Oh, you, oh, you found a uh, giant boss in the uh, middle of the Mounds of the Dead, did you? Yes, I did, and I would like some help, please. You want to kill it? You think it has a I cool think little it... uh, fragment of power or something? Maybe. I want to see. I I've never been here before, and we don't exactly, uh, you know. I don't usually spend a lot of time in the Mounds of the Dead. Ooh, I need to bring out my main weapon more often. This thing actually hits hard. What was that? I can kill things. I can, like, two-shot skeletons with my normal weapon. Oh, right. You're using your sword, huh? Oh, jeez. That's the big Instead guy coming your... to me! You're supposed to stay in your little ring! Oh. Is he not cooperating? Uh, he's trying to find his way to me. I'm waiting for you. Oh, you were in there already. Okay. He's only a one skull. I know, but... I was surrounded by five other people as well. There were like four other skeletons that were... Okay. What is this? Thorgar's recipe fragment. You can use it. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, you you you're the uh, person who collects those things. Do I... Oh, I also have. Oh, that's my tome. Never mind. This thing is cool. Look at it. It's all glowy. Except there's no E to interact on it. Oh, this thing. Yeah, this thing does not have an interact button. Interesting. It's just here. There's a chest here. I was trying to look in. Ooh, two more forgotten banners. Nice. A note. Grab the money. <laughs> My money. Demon fire orb. What's that? Uh, it's a orb with fire. It's a throwing weapon. Yeah, you, you throw a giant explosive orb. Oh, do you have to harvest this guy to get like a key out of him or something? Oh, maybe. You wanna try? Here, I'll try. No, I know. No, none of that. I know it said that tomorrow has enough troubles on it, of its own but, and all, but a heads up wouldn't hurt, right? <laughs> let us know if. Oh, let us know if anything's. T oh. <laughs> That's what that was. <laughs> You are so confused there. I, I missed a few messages before with the issue. I'm like, huh? What's going on? The um, thing I like is it's not. It's uh, always now time everywhere. Oh, abandoned again. Very profound. Yeah, I'm going back to the central areas. Are you actually going to look it up on the wiki? What's that? Are you going to look it up on the wiki? Uh. It just gave me a teleport location, and I don't want to type that in with admin commands. So, I'm going to keep looking. Hey! We should be able to find it much easier with light now, though, Ella. We should, yes. <laughs> Did you see me jump? Nah, just think, here, just chuckling at their uh, at their comments about uh, time zones in the future. 
Very nice, don't attack me. So close. those healing things from you though. Uh, I'm starting as a bad to grab. Have you been like trying to loot these guys at all? Or no? Nope. Okay. Found it. All the way over there. Okay. Oh, that's a chest. Might not be trying to. Wow, there's two more of those things. Oh no. <laughs> oh, they started singing. <laughs> what? Uh, you, you'll have to. You'll have to read to catch up. <laughs> Part of the steel hatchet just stuck into the wall. Oh. Oh, jeez. Um. Yeah. Yep, he's singing. Duck and hide, <laughs> run. Actually, he's a pretty Ooh, there's singer. people. Hi. Wow, it's so, so surprising. There's people. No, there's non skeleton people. Oh, pff. Non skeletal people. <laughs> oh, ow. <gasps> really? Oh my gosh, I'm actually dead. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I still haven't found my bed! Uh, you should bind to your bed. I found my bed! Grab those arrows. Yeah, it's over here, Ella. <laughs> that looks tattered. I wonder if the, the other one we could make is not gonna be tattered. We'll see. Um, can you go find my body and protect it? I actually cannot, because I do not have a marker. <laughs> To cause trouble here. Ah! Ah! All the way to the second hole again. Like the awesome drummer Muppet <laughs> animals. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you both make my, me laugh. My father and is make currently unhinged today. <laughs> he had a long day of work. I think he's losing it. Actually, it wasn't a long day of work, but I don't know. He's still losing it. I did not think I would be cringing so hard at oh. something today. Oh! Alchemical decor! Knowledge! Uh. Ah. 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 Yes, I am. Okay, uh... I have to go all the way home, bind <laughs> to a bed. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Uh-oh. See, I always call him ancient. I just asked him about the dinosaurs. <laughs> Muppet notes unhinged. Actually, valid point. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I want to go check out that knowledge, though. I just found this uh, cool knowledge, and it sounds like I'll be able to make the alchemy stuff. Where's the thing? Chemical decor. Uh, That's where right from the animals. Codices, go. manuals, this is perfect jars, for the elixir, draught, potion, paper, bottle. This is the library stuff I've been looking That's for. That's what we need. That is wonderful. Uh, mounds of the dead, please. And apparently town signs as well. 
Uh, there wasn't those paper things that Yeah, we it was about. alchemy paper specifically. Oh, it was alchemy decor paper. This is the one yeah, then, huh? that's the one. Nice. A paper depicting in a, a demonic pentagram. Uh-oh. Why are you calling us ancient? No, that's rude. Uh... Oh, no, he's saying he's the one that trained the ancients. He's saying he's as old as it's the universe. Oh. He's, he, oh, he's, he... he's pulling the I'm insulted to be considered only ancient card. <laughs> I kind of know what the next that thing that comes almost next. almost shot me. I, I kind of know what comes next after ancient, and I am not entirely sure I want to say what it is. Yet. Oh, I have my body back. Hey, I'm over here. Can you please come help me on this mound and at least keep them away from me okay, while I grab my here? stuff? Over there. Literally on top of this thing. Because my stuff is here. Those guys. Those guys. Oh, these guys? Get them. Get them. Those guys <laughs> killed me. I hardly ever die. So if I beat them, then I'm better? No. Ah! No? I already killed half of them. Oh. Yeah, you did. <laughs> there you go. Hey, it was worth a try. Let's see what this has. I want to use this. It has 1,000 plant fiber. Yay! We needed plant fiber. Oh, well, I'm over encumbered. Do you want to hold some stuff for me? Okay. What do you got? One second. Uh, want to hold some armor for me? Armor? Hey, I told you, I have a wardrobe. Oh, your ward... What are you finding? Oh, you're finding... Oh, I'll take the banners for sure. Actually, we've got five banners. That should be enough. So theoretically, we didn't even need to learn it. Or paint too, huh? I haven't learned it yet, but I still want to because it's nice. Hey, this time. way. I was on my way, and then I got cornered. <laughs> she with these guys at all? Okay, where's that alchemy stuff? Ah, yes. I don't know if this is tattered or not yet. Uh, you'll find it here, Ella. Right inside. Ooh. Yeah, alchemy decor. Yay! Did you find a chest in here? Yes, there is one! Uh, two more banners. Armor rebalance kit. Okay, no, never mind. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot to look for chests too. I haven't been doing it, but I've been trying to, while also trying to keep up. I I just came here for the banner. Okay, this way. While well, we're here, I think I want to try looting some more people. You want to try looting people? I want to go work on castle. But what's an E to interact? There was a castle, or there was a thing here. Ah! Why am I getting an E to interact, though? So... <gasps> that guy has an interesting axe. Uh. Oh, there's a book here. Found a book. Specialist Cooking 3. Ah! Hello. I missed. Thank you. I'm sorry. It's right here. Circled soul a few more times than me. But not too many more. Right here. Yes. Okay. I want to head home. Okay. Home. Oh. Uh, is it easier to run to Yamatai Castle, or is it easier to run through the north? Yamatai Castle, because I get cold in the north. Yeah, you die before we make it. I... That would be debatable. I don't have super cold, super good cold gear. Also, your headband and your Heat or... Oh. And yeah, your hands. Missing a lot of things. What do I need to repair? Layered silk. Looks like I'll have to do that at home. Well, now that we have alchemy Ah, welcome, stuff. welcome. 
Hello, Father. Is he in chat? I, I, is. I, I have been in the Discord this entire time, and I have turned it on so that people can hear you. So that uh, I wouldn't have some weird, oh, I can hear you, they can't, or uh, they can hear you, I can't. I problem. lost again, because I was busy trying to get the Discord, and you decided to leave me. I'm just heading home. How's it going? Good. We found found the two banners if you want. I'll, we'll show you them to the. We'll show you them when we get there. Ooh. Where did you spawn in? It's been uh, probably forever since we've been We made a big on, castle. Huh? Do you want yeah, yeah, We did a big fight at last time, remember? Oh, that big castle! Oh, you're in the desert there. Do you want to mm -hmm. empty out your inventory uh, when you get to the oh, black? Yeah. Get the black castle. Please. Uh, keep in mind, you will find a map room at the sinkhole. Yes, there is one there. Oh, thank you. What about my inventory? When you get to the castle, can you empty out your inventory into just some random chests and then I'll go <laughs> and I'll, I'll sort it out later? Just so we see what all there is. There you are. Found you. I remember how to play, sure. Uh, WASD. You mm -hmm. don't have water, do you? Oh, it was food. Well, it was water, but Lasting Feast gives both food and water, though. Oh. That's why I wanted to eat Lasting Feast first. Because it's a feast? Uh, because it would fill both up. Because it's a feast? Kind of feast like. Yeah. A feast includes both food and drink. Oh, that's Dad. Yeah, I can hear now. <laughs> yes, he just joined our... Uh, he just joined. We'll meet up with him shortly. Uh, Father. When you get back to the castle, uh, could you look into uh, making some layered silk for me? <coughs> layered silk, huh? Yeah. And He's hello, right. old man young. Old man young. <laughs> 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 that's great. He's currently running around barefoot. Yeah, the rocks are uncomfortable. Why am I discovering terrain that I've been used to go through a lot of times? It's, it's strange. A, it's weird sometimes. I found that happens. It's I had to like download the oh, mod yeah. and everything as well. Oh yes. I, f I had forgotten about that. It's a, it's a great mod, honestly. It oh, is. crap. That's, how does one hold on to a wall again? Wow, that was a lot of very, very low yeah. serving. Oh. Uh, it's, it's space space against yeah. yeah. Space, space and then against you can the wall. Just, yeah, yeah, and then C to let go. I'm used to C being character. So I usually go to press X to yeah. get off the walls, but that's not how that works. They play a little no. Genshin, and it's literally swapped where X is let go. And that's uh, gotta be awkward in a pinch. Screen. Oh, it it definitely is. It definitely uh, after play, swapping from one game to the other, it's uh, kind of disorienting. All right, there's a giant triple skull gator there. Forgot about that. <laughs> That's We're a thing. going from. Where is he at? <laughs> oh, you got a boar behind you. It's gonna charge. Oh, I know. Oh, he just charged me. I'm okay though. Okay, good. Yeah, we're going from like uh, Conan or Genshin to uh, League, and it's just like I just accidentally used flash. Yeah, W A S D. Whoops, I flashed. <laughs> I just flashed in place. Um, no one saw this right <laughs> as I'm getting like. Mm, Missing person pinged or whatever. The question mark one. <laughs> yeah. That's the way to live, Brett. Yes. Uh, uh, wait. Yes. Swagger Rock. Sinkhole. Oh! By the summoning plant? No, where's the sinkhole? There's the sinkhole. I went the wrong way. Oh. Oh well. Oh, well. It's 
definitely still probably faster for you to go sinkhole and then up to the castle. Yeah. Of course, you could try running to the uh, Yamatai castle, but... That's where I was headed. Ah. I kind of wish I could harvest dandelions and daisies in this game so I could plant them. Just daisies? for potting? Yeah. Oh, because you see all these dandelions and daisies and other flowers and some of them aren't pickupable. When you questioned me, I thought it's because, oh, do you have not have your graphics high enough to see them? Oh, no, I, I do. I, I can see them. Okay. On that note, I should be swapping my uh, encoder over to use my CPU and not my graphics card. I'm running in the wrong direction. Uh, not playing with what? Uh, thralls? Is that what you mean? Oh, that is that a big old sense. spider. Thralls make sense. I couldn't make heads or tails of it. Ella, you are being chased, huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I know I can one-shot them, but... Also, I keep pressing R to try to, uh... Sheath my weapon. But X is sheathing? Be uh, because I've been playing Skyrim. And Skyrim, R is for, uh, sheath and unsheath weapon. But X is sheath and unsheath weapon. Uh, we're not really playing with thralls. I don't usually like playing with thralls. I usually like having the freedom of running around and I not have dealing with them. I a cat that I got to level 10 and then I just haven't gotten the chance to take them with me. We actually had plan had thralls and had a bunch planned to for the for the um fortress and then uh when we started building that there was a bug in the current version at the time that wasn't letting you place thralls close well, you could you could build to but no build place thralls. Yeah. yeah. Like just out like of a no way build zone, further there was a the no giant zone. area that you could not place thralls. Yeah. Uh, it was it like was very basically awkward. twice as far as it should have been, so Fortunately that was patched out and we're okay now. Yeah, but we just never done it since. I placed one to test it. And of course you can't pick them back up again, so And the <laughs> animals are there. What? The animals are there. Oh, the animals are there. I thought yes. you said all the animals are dead. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> Panic time. I'll have to show you all the animals when we get there. I named them. And they're oh, nice. all greater ones as well. And I'll show you my cat that I... Oh. Father, you still have Connery here at the uh, Yamata castle as well. Yay! You should bring Connery if you want. You should. I suppose I can probably actually get him to follow me through the teleport, can't I? Yes, you can. Yeah. Uh, are you so. heading back? Or where are you at? I'm sorry, I'm having a hard time hearing because there's such a commotion outside. <laughs> yeah, they're right outside the door. I had a hard time getting in. I'm not seeing the layered silk here. I, th I must have taken it all. It's probably all back at the base, yeah. Let's head back. Yeah, this is the this is the current or the the, the, the previous place. We had a nice uh, well, still have, but uh, we don't spend a whole lot of time here anymore. No, no, we don't. But oh, hey. This is a glowing sword. Ooh. It's another strength, but bring it with if you want and I will enjoy it. And yeah, we got some legendary weapons here too, I should grab, huh? My one legendary weapon is um, is gonna run out soon and we'll need to go fight the la the uh, wine cellar again Mortal so I can get it back. Mordlin. Legendary what? corrupted weapon. Battle Axe of Berserkers. Unintelligible. Another Mordlin. Granite Axe. Battle Axe of the Berserkers. Yogg's Torch. Also a glowing weapon? Is that? Was that one also a glowing weapon or no? I thought it would be with a name like Yogg's Torch, but it is not, unfortunately. Hmm. What was that purple? 
And here's all the other legendary weapons. Oh, there's more. I took the knives, remember? So I, I took one of each knife so that I could try and see how it would look with the kitchen. Ah, uh, yes. How many of you are using their... Yeah, just as I thought. Everyone decided to go with a... Uh... Oh. They all decided instead of using spears that they would use their truncheons. So they are not able to finish killing the wolves. I equipped them for, with trunches just so that so that they would be able to uh, knock out thralls during a purge. And now they're not the most effective guards against animals. <laughs> I'll just I'll just keep beating them again and again, doing no damage, because uh, animals can't be knocked out. I've got one Ooh, elk head. Did you have another elk still? head or no? I don't think I have an elk head. I had a elk king head. Or, yeah, trophy. Okay, I've got one elk no. head. I need another one. No. The final one. Oh yeah, I want to see what this mysterious bell is. Oh, that's really big. Dogs of the Desert Banner, huh? That's one of the different banner types. Hanuman's Gata. Interesting. Add some more legendary weapons. Steal them out of my father's chest. What? <laughs> Heresy. I was totally planning to use those. Then I Wait, shall I have a chest. bequeath them also. to you. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, there was in the, in the old place. See, we've uh, got plenty of thralls that we tamed. Uh, all of these are either uh, thrall three or thrall threes or higher, um, and most of them we moved already to the over to the other castle. So we've got a few of them. Uh, oh, there's a blacksmith too, but that's like the lowest level you'll find. Um, yeah. We did some, uh, we did some thrall tamings. Ella's already over at the castle, huh? Yep. Is father over there as well? No, not yet. Where are you at? Just, uh... Oh, you're on, on the, my way. Uh, Wandering through. Hey there. I was just okay. getting, responding to uh, the Discord. The ruins of old Nebthu. Just taking an old, familiar path. I'm gonna have a peek at what it takes to actually uh, make this leather things that I need. Uh, I mean, not le leather things. I mean, silk. It's only silk and alchemical base. That's actually not bad at all. For which? The layered silk. Oh, that's good. Let me just find that alchemical base. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's all good. Uh... Wow. Yeah. That's an impressive, uh, impressive hammer. That uh, Hanuman's Gata Legendary War Club uh, weighs 50 pounds. <laughs> it hits like a truck. Yeah. Oh yeah, when you get here, I want to use the bell. I think I may have said that already. Oh, the bell. Yes. I want to see the bell. The mysterious bell. You mean like a vintage story bell? <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> no. No, that okay. That would be terrifying. Reasonable. <laughs> that did kind of terrify you when we were doing that. Yeah, that was reasonably scary. Yeah. Um, I out of nowhere. Absolutely not. I didn't get, like, 
hyper freaked out by it. I'm just like, we need to leave now. <laughs> yeah. All right. You know, be be right back in an hour. All right. Well. Uh. Okay. Uh, I was just thinking about when we we're going to do our castle tour. All right, you go ahead. He can always rewind. He can he can rewind. We'll be it's doing YouTube. a castle tour here. It is YouTube. Uh, so yeah. And you can watch it in fast mode when you go back. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Uh, how much how much layered silk do I need? I probably didn't need that much. All right. Yeah, we'll be uh, we'll be giving my father a tour for sure. I know that uh, it's been a little while since he's been around, so. Mm-hmm. That's a lot of. You found a lot of gosmer, huh? I We've got over three thousand gosmer, and I'm it... about to turn it all into. Uh, put some more on, right? I did. I just turned the oven on. I I didn't look like it was crafting. It was. It's gone. No, it's not actually crafting. It's a recipe, Ella. Oh. Yeah, you have to craft the recipe, and then I'll turn the stove on. You're just using fuel. Needs to be on. Now you can. No? Okay. Have a little patience. It doesn't seem to be uh, wanting to cooperate. Apparently not. Father could be already home and like standing amidst all the guards and I wouldn't even notice. <laughs> I'm just saying that because he's got the same armor. I play please I, I play PC games a lot, don't work much. PC games are fun. So way to go. Oh right, you're in that set of armor. Hello, father. Hello. Long time no see. Welcome. Hi, hi. Let's head home. And I would what, love to show you this around. This isn't home. No, no, no not home anymore. I, I Looks think I strangely familiar. Nice hmm. I think I still do have my nice bed. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I did actually make a really cozy place. I uh, I like how it, how it turned out. Just nice and simple, cozy. Oh. I'm serenading Young as he departs for his journey. I feel all powerful. I'm standing on the map. I can see it like it's so small. <laughs> Alright, I need to repair my gear. That's what I came here for. Well, I forgot uh, there's some cats. For. Wandering all over the fortress. Yep, lots of cats. <laughs> I told Ella oh, that uh, if she wants house cats, she can leave them in her room. <laughs> She's got her <laughs> own room. Uh, I might only have one. We'll see. Can't remember how to open the hatch when you're not in, on it. Oh, is it uh, not open? It's open on my screen. No. Right, have to hit. I keep ordering him to move instead. Like for some, oh, you were in the way now. I'm sorry. For some reason, that's for some reason I can't. No, I just climb when I hit it. Then I can't tell it to open. Look up and press E. No, I'm doing that. I understand. Okay. I'm doing that. That's just oh, now right. it's open. Did you just open it? No, it was open that entire time. To you, I watched me. you crawl yeah. right through it. Yeah, I know. It's, it's bizarre. Is this where we're heading home? Yes, it is. Whoosh. Yeah, that's funny. I always enter the teleporter, and anyone else who, during my teleportation sequence, 
tries to teleport with me, uh, gets to teleport, and then I like get left behind. Mm-hmm. It's too bad that the render distance doesn't work on the fortress. Oh, yeah. Oops. You can only see one face of it right from this, from on my screen. Yeah. They did a great job on the sound, uh, snow sound, though. Yeah. The wind. No, the crunching, the... Oh, the, the crunch. Uh, not crunching, the... It's only, it's only a snow sound, that's what it is. The sound of snow under your boots when it's really cold. Yeah, that's what it is. It's just the snow pack packing. Yeah. Yeah. Yay, stand around. Cool. All right. Good. Now you can see it live, and you can uh, have plenty of input. Tell us what you think about the castle. Goodbye, Nana. I'm getting his putrid meat. What? Oh, well, that was just something rotting. Weird. <laughs> uh, this isn't really much. I was just extrapolating it to see what it would look like as a uh, as a wall. Hmm. Yes. I think and it would look better if it was just walls instead of the foundation pieces. What do you mean? Well, it could be, uh... Like, this is foundations, right? Yeah. You could have a, a base path of foundations, I suppose, but... If it was three wide, so it was like walls instead of foundations on this edge. So it was thin, opening up the inside. That wouldn't be bad. Yeah. Similar to what we had in the old one. I don't exactly remember what the old one was for the wall. Mm -hmm. uh, but you'll also notice that there are uh, actually doors all the way up on this side as well. There's a line? Um, getting glitched on Conrad. Where? Uh, on this side, I've actually put doors that uh, would be able to access the inside of the uh, the wall. Right oh, now, it's just um, right now it's just a temporary thing. But... Looks good. And, and those are actually on different levels of the stair as well. So, welcome to home. Oh, hey. I do love the uh, the black ice look. That oh, is an actually, I want to show you the view from over here. I saw that. I saw that clip. Yeah, it just the Ymir. It looks so good. Mm -hmm. Just sitting on top and glowing like that. Yeah, that does look good. We just need another one of those uh, totems. Mm -hmm. But I much prefer the look of the uh, the look of the tops of the towers now. After changing those, mm -hmm. turns out turned out much better. Yeah, so look good. we need some water. We've got plenty of water. Don't ask me where it comes from because it comes. Well, actually, Magic. I can tell you where it comes from. It's straight from Mitra. That's the statue of Mitra. He just gives us some water. Mm -hmm. It's very nice out of, of the Out of the in endless bowl. Yeah. Not magic at all. It's miraculous. Well, this is... Weird. I like it. 
It's weird. Yeah. I like it. My thoughts exactly. I it managed. Fits. To, uh -huh. Yeah, I managed to put a curtain in behind, and it just it yeah. just that contrast just makes them pop. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I got a bit of workstations. Those will disappear in a bit. Mm -hmm. Um, I guess another thing that we need to do is dealing with these benches. Um, the snow built up into this one. Yes. Uh, your fault. <laughs> the snow that one's just is... snow. Uh, yes, this, this is a vault. My door. Let's <laughs> <laughs> start the first Quick, floor. Conroy, keep him out while I, while oh, I rob the vault. Wait! It's empty! Where is it gone? Yeah, we haven't put anything in it yet. No. Oh. It is fantastic and exciting. Please, show me to my room so I can... Uh... Ah, yes. Well, uh, this is what we were doing last stream, all of the... Uh... Oh, yeah, and then Meteor also gives us light. Don't! Oh. Um, uh, so yeah, we got all these curtains up last stream, and we got all the tables like here, the and the campfire. It took us a while, Ella and I, just oh, deciding on the curtains. The horns, nice. E e yeah, Ella put up the horns. <laughs> um, I found some Kinskirn statues for Ella as well. It's just statues of Ella. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. It totally does look like... Exact got the same, same armor. Yeah. Then, these are the floating curtains I was telling you about. The impossible floating curtains. That's cool. So, yeah. They're held up by zip ties. <laughs> Welcome to the kitchen. Oh, yes. <clears throat> I, 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 kitchen, I, you I, call it. All I see is a brewing cauldron of black ash popping and pulling out of the middle. That seems... Uh, just because you can't see the food doesn't mean it's not there. <laughs> it means it's charred to ash. It looks like it's just a... I don't know. That's our large wok. Yes. It's gotta, very build, it's gotta feed the entire The oil acid. is too hot. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I like the uh, the knife stand with the uh, black ice. Is it black ice? No, what are those? Are those, uh, black those ice? are the star metal. And then know. there's also the King Slayer daggers. Nice. That is that's the top one there. Oh, and then we have uh, the battle spatula. Uh, the, the battle spatulas. All right. Go ahead and put it in nice. your hand. Yeah, I'll grab this one. Hold on, I must equip the mighty battle spatula. I can't find my mighty battle spatula. It didn't go into my inventory bar very well. There we go. Aha! Ah! <laughs> uh, yeah, we've been finding some uh, suitable kitchen <laughs> kitchen utensils. It's fantastic. Ella's been doing a lot of good work on the kitchen. It looks awesome. Um, <laughs> I did like most of the furniture in this a place. Picture of a she's boiling been... cauldron. Yeah, like I, I plan the stoves and the tables and like the cauldron mm -hmm. and such. And uh, then she went ahead with uh, all of the decorations. It looks alive, like it. Fa looks yeah, nice. found out we could use these barrel lids as cutting boards. Mm-hmm. Uh, we gotta remove one of these cupboards and make room for the uh, fluid press and the dryer, I think. And uh, the bar? We, yeah. The bar yeah. that you haven't spent your 12 hours a bottle? Uh, that's, that was supposed to be today. Of cups? Yeah, that was <clears> supposed <throat> to be today. I did. I have actually... I warn you, I think fast forward it? the part where he does the mugs. <laughs> You don't I have that many lives. Last time, <laughs> last time I made the bar, 
I actually legitimately spent five hours stacking, what was it, seven or mugs. nine different, uh, just mugs. Like, tankers. Um, so, from here... Up, uh, up the ladder is the above mm -hmm. the uh, kitchen area. Mm -hmm. Which isn't done yet, but I think it's This is also right now. what we're working on today here. Uh, we'll probably put in more of these tables. I like that table. Yeah, it's, it's quite nice. It's a good size. And mm -hmm. uh, the fireplace and the... Uh, and this feels like it, it should feel be like a hunting lodge or really cozy. This feels like it should have like big pillow mats, big uh, pillow chairs around it. Maybe, and maybe like kingly lounging, you know. Mm -hmm. I was going to put fire... pillows on the chairs, so spot where they actually sit and eat most of the time because they're like just chilling out lounging. Yeah, with their big tankards of beer. And we we're also thinking of like adding possibly some games like there's a very mm -hmm. large version mm -hmm. of checkers for example yeah. too much time I, i'm telling you though okay what took so long was the weird hitboxes it was really hard to line up mm -hmm. um and i made like a pyramid of mugs is what i did which it was uh, not designed to allow going back no definitely not uh going back to the I'm bottom on the, floor here I'm on, oh i'm on the next oh, floor you're on the next floor you went up through there. You gotta go through the main staircase to get the, the proper experience. Um, the other thing is... Uh, we were thinking about making this room also a bit of dining, and like maybe like this is the back breakfast room. Mm. Or, uh, or some meeting other... Meeting hall. Some other meeting area. Something like that. Some nice Did you change there. anything in this section? Uh, oh, yes, like we have. This Very is the library. Nice. Oh, I really like this. Yeah. It's so it's so educational and knowledgeable. 90 to 95% oh, of this was books. Ella. Scroll. She did an amazing job at all the decorations here. This is awesome. This is really awesome. And yeah, once we found the Emberlight mod and we found out that we could do bookshelves and journals... Mm -hmm. Um, and now, well, clearly, oh, Ella, have clearly you more books are needed. Now? Yes, I have. Ah, good. ah, nice. The these books, the codices. It looks almost we like just, a shelf from Skyrim, where you've got the, all the potions together that you go and you grab. And yeah, the potions and uh, we found some new alchemy supplies knowledge over by the mounds of the dead, and she mm -hmm. put that to work right away with all these. Uh, Books that are actually books and books that are different instead of all these journals. Mm hmm. Uh, so, so that quite nice. There, so I like it. Yeah. Well, the There's... proper library would be mostly just writings of, of thinkers, right? So that makes sense. And a lot of scrolls. Yeah. And plenty of comfy places for reading or studying. Exactly. Uh, we, we did some individual stacks of scrolls as well. And uh, I like the receptionist yeah. table, uh, receptionist counter. Uh, this is our re receptionist. It's the uh, it's mm -hmm. the staff. All oh, right. Yes. <laughs> the talking staff of. Yep. That's uh, that place is going to be for. Um, Uh, for like uncatalog, uh, catalog books and such, probably. Mm -hmm. Gonna just like stack it. a bunch of books in there. It's a good chandelier for it too. Yeah. Yeah, uh, that's the Kaitan. and these little wall. They did a good job on up. these rugs. This yeah. rug with the setting with the, the video I found a got, really nice. big one. Like that. That almost looks like you can on my screen. Anyways, almost looks like you can see the. Oh, yeah. We they don't have round rugs, but I tried They don't to... have round rugs. We were looking. No, it just this. it looks like a the you can almost look like you can see the texture to it. It's really nicely done. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'd like to play with better graphic settings, but my computer does not like me. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll do we'll continue on the tower. 
What is uh, a transporty stone? Yeah. Transportery stone. Um, if we set up one of these someplace else, we'll be able to teleport between the two locations. Ah, so this is the waiting room for uh, translocation. Um, <laughs> yeah, it sounds like one of those places you would have in an MMORPG that everyone just like waits around and yeah, yeah. This is this is where you queue up for your next uh, next yeah. instance dungeon. Yeah, that sounds about right. That's the idea. <laughs> That's awesome. And it's Up meant to be a bit of um, of an entertainer place as well because uh, that thing gives it, tra it teleports you, but it gives you a ton of corruption. Ah, yes. Circle of power. This is for summoning things. You could summon your corpse here as well if you uh, if you so need to. With if the uh, with the right sorcery spell, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Very epic. And of course, the map room. Oh my gosh, the the boar and wolf are still. <laughs> we haven't touched. Yeah, we, we yeah it is. is we, ha we haven't touched this place. It's made its home there, so. Yeah. All right, got her. Oh right. crap! This will move too fast. <laughs> mm. Okay, you know. Yeah, we will definitely get dancers. That's the one thing that we don't really have. Well, you did also... disassemble the workstation. Oh yes, we did. Yeah, we we transported like we've got the workstations there. We um, so we transferred everything over. Everything is now functional in the castle, which is exciting. Mm -hmm. Also, I just realized that there was just a missing square in the middle of here. Uh, oh, we're missing... Uh, that's awkward. We're missing we're stability here. Where? Oh. Why? I'm not sure. I'll have to look at that. Something underneath. Yeah. this wall in here. Going to the bottom Ooh. floor. I was doing some stuff with pillars. Maybe it didn't attach proper. I don't know. I need to grab silly. my other oh. hammer to check all the stability. That's right. It's not crashing down around our heads right now, so that's good. Yeah. Be good. Okay, back to floor one. Wait a second. Okay, floor Where's one. The Getting lost in the magic y uh, blood sucky room. In now down through the library. Okay. At floor one. I'm taking a shortcut. <laughs> Ow. You just go outside? <laughs> yes. Oh. That was the shortcut. Otherwise, we would have went to, had to go through a lot of stairs. See. Alright, uh... Stairs are uh, designed for downwards, you know this, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I guess we can go through the other tower now. I'm coming Walk this time. Uh, we don't have anything yet in these bottom rooms. Uh, we've got three full floors here that are very small rooms, but we don't really have anything in them yet at all. One could be a wine cellar. It yes. could be. Uh... I the suppose. most secure part of the deep depths of the place, you have to get I past should. the vault guards to get to the wine. I should show you guys the uh, Conroy. the secret wine cellar. Ah, yes. Ooh. An apiary? Yeah, well, this is the garden. Hmm. Uh, apiaries are just above us. Yeah, this is a place I still haven't finished yet because I've been busy with the library. Yeah. What is, what is a water planter? It's for um, water. it's for planting things like the orange ficus and the other things that oh. and the glowing goop, things oh, that grow inside awesome. the water. Little bench. Press you, E on it. I I can't. It keeps uh, in the, the way. Out. You have to go up the stairs and then you can enter. Yeah. It's, it's bizarre. <laughs> so then Conroy. Yeah, is too Conroy's just in the way. If you move Conroy, then hey Conroy. Okay. 
He wasn't in the way for me. What? Oh! <laughs> See, yeah, it's it's bizarre. Because <laughs> you actually sit down from above it. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. And then above is the functional. Um, is the the functional um, arbor? Oh. Yeah. The actual apiary. Yeah. Uh, this can also grow grapes. We have it set to grow vines right now because we don't have grapes yet. And then we've got plenty of um, we've got plenty of composting. This is the Emberlake uh, mod. Yep. Yes. That is. I like it. Uh, we placed. Um, it's actually f three different arbors mixed together. We've got the regular arbor, Silkworms. which is bigger, and then we've got two decorative arbors that we put inside of the main one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Yeah, silkworms came yeah, with the mod worms. too, and then there's mushroom boxes. Silkworms eat. Uh, yeah, we haven't done anything with mushrooms. Silkworms eat gray flower lupine and only gray flower lupine. So, uh, so that's why we've got the gray see. flower lupine above. It's just, it's just decorative. It's not functional. Uh, but the gray flower lupine we're actually growing here. Yeah, yeah. On these planters. Nice. Uh, we've got the stove here for converting the silkworm cocoons into silk. We've got some water buck water water barrels, horticulturalist bench. Dryer for um, drying plants to make seeds. We've got a grinder to. Uh, for compost. For yeah, for compost, and then like campfire the each with a um, essence of rot. To rot food for Sorry. compost. Um and essence Wait, of rot will. Essence of rot. Yeah, it hyper rots foods. So if it's in there, food just super rots. Yeah, it's like a it's like you're cooking the food, but instead you're rotting it super hyper fast. Hmm. Um, so, yeah, just Good in case, like, place. you need lots of, um, like, uh, rotten food for compost, right? Because you need mm -hmm. compost to grow everything. And, and, yeah, and then dark room for the, uh, the mushroom boxes. And, uh, vines everywhere, because vines are lovely. Mm -hmm. And then there's more up here. Yes. Over here... Uh, we still have not put our planters here, but I want one of each planter, or like six different planters in a row here. Um, mm -hmm. One with each of the different types of lotuses. Mm -hmm. Like the special lotuses. Mm -hmm. Right now, we've only got uh, five of the types. Lotus, we still need yellow to lotus. five blacks. And then we got a bunch of extra yellow lotus here. And we still need more things to plant. Probably but. aloe as well, potentially. And we have, we, you still have some more um, side planters and decorations. Mm -hmm. And then you may have missed it, but this is actually a oh, I little totally closet. Did. Yep. Oh, you know what else we missed in the in the gardens? What's in the garden? What did Come we miss? With me. Show me, show me, show me. All the way something? down here, and then come behind here. Oh, oh yeah. And go in. The brewery. Yeah. yeah. The secret still. <laughs> the hidden still. The, it is the, ac accessible from the rest as well. The thought was because you'd have the grapes nearby, so instead of hauling them to mm -hmm. like the kitchen or something, you just do it here. I love this. This is really impressive, guys. It's, it's I like the lamp too. Done, yeah. The lantern over top of yeah. the lamps too. Yeah. The potted plants. This is all part of the. Uh, Emberlite yeah. mod, right? Yeah. This whole thing's Emberlite, really essentially. Nice. Yeah, if you oh, except for the look uh, at the thing straight on, it looks really cool. Because then you've got the one green on the statue and then the red beside it. It took yeah. forever to do. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Then, of course, you've seen the very top, which is the shrine. I think I have, yeah. We haven't done anything with it in quite a while, but I don't think we will though. Because this is the temple. Honestly, what else? Uh, yes, yeah, the, the temple. Sorry, it was a shrine. We upgraded it all, mm -hmm. all the way. This is the temple to Mitra, and uh, it was big, so we had to put it. Uh, I wanted it to be in a room so it would be cozy, but yeah, it was too big, so we had to put it on the roof. <laughs> 
The gods are not affected by your mortal cold. It honestly looks really cool to have the open top. Yeah, it's... It's great. <laughs> I might put a couple more decorations in here, but not much. Maybe some statues of guidance at the very top? Possibly. Uh, then, we also have the roof, which we haven't done a whole lot with. Uh, essentially, it's just the Ymir Shrine, for now. But, uh, I've got, I've got some plans here. On this side, we're gonna have an archery range. Oh yes, we can make Ooh, archery range. I ranges. like the joke. Ice shard arrows. Yes, nice. we got lots. Uh, I want to make a, um, an archery range. And I want a, like... <laughs> uh, dibs, <laughs> dibs on not being the one to collect the overshots. <laughs> that's right, well, what, that's, that's what Ymir is for. We just pray to him and ask for more arrows. We lost our last. Please, Please, I missed again. Please, I missed again. <laughs> yeah. uh, I also want to put in here a. Post a dancer like, at them. What like is a... them? Young? Uh, that was the tele or the teleporter. Oh yes, 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 yes. Yeah. 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 That's I, I was intending to make the teleporter room look a little more, like, uh, I don't know. You know, like how in the Durketto, um, mm -hmm. DLC, it, like, kind of, it, everything looks more, more luxurious and... Comfy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's kind of what I was going for, because then you'd have the dancers around you, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I want to put a fight pit up here. Or a militia training area. You know, if we can on top, find, yeah. if we can yeah, find those um, barricades, we train in the cold. If Richard we can, Nords. If we can find those barricades, like the wooden ones, we could put those around because they're kind of short, but they're wooden. They got the slats on them. Mm-hmm. Question: Are we all Norhammer? Dream? No. Hmm? Are you Sumerian? I think so. I guess people haven't seen my character's face. Hello. Ah! Hello. What happened to your helmet? <laughs> I think Father and I are both Nordheimer. I don't think. Uh, is there a way to check? I don't know. That's right. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure I am Sumerian. He looks Sumerian. I think. Pretty sure I am. Okay, it's cold. I'm going inside. Do, did he see our rooms yet? Or no, I haven't uh, seen them. No, we, we have explored the towers. We have not explored the other floors. Then we shall go to So the we're going into floor three now. Yeah, it doesn't say. All right. We're going in here. Yep. Floor three. Uh, of course, we've got this room on all the floors. And that's just a uh, little bit of a... Um, well, let's attach to the gatehouse. Uh, it's above the gatehouse. There's another one. Guard, the guard room. Yeah. It's like the guard's prep room. One of the guard rooms. And um, right attached, um, right in here, we have smithing, tinkery, um, carpentry, leatherworking. Carpentry is level we have like an entire oh, no, base carpentry. in like yeah. a, what is this, six by six? It it's was... a gigantic castle with everything stuck in a 6x6. Six six. <laughs> yeah, it I was a... It. Well, we have another room. Okay, it's two 6x6s. Six Plant-based tannery. Mm -hmm. That's different. Uh, yeah, those are the upgrades. So this plant-based tannery is um, the fuel-efficient one. So it mm. takes less bark. Since it's not exactly easy to get mm -hmm. bark up here. Gotcha. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I labeled the chests over here. I love I, I loved your idea with the uh, stacking the chests on the shelf. But we need to oh, find yes, more yeah, of yeah. those shelves. I, I want yeah. more of those shelves. I've only found uh Large I think this is actually shelf. the one that you had earlier and I stole it. Brought it over from the other way, yeah. Yeah. Actually there might be more from the other place. Yeah. I wanna put another one here. We're it gonna, does look we're good. Need like lots that. Of storage. There's a chest mm -hmm. here at the tannery that isn't a. That's an actual chest here yeah. too for leatherworks. Yeah, it's nice. It, it's, it fits it's, right in. Aside from the the person's foot being stuck in it, that's yeah. as, that's as, I I try to move it over as much as I could without it going yeah. into the wall. 
That looks good. Um, we also got hammers. fluid press for oils. Fluid press. Mm -hmm. And in the other room, across from the hall. Oh yeah, this is also I attached should, to... I should drop off some of this stuff, eh? Probably. <laughs> um, this is also attached to the arbor, right? So we, we wanted the functional side, the crafting stuff, to be right beside. So you need you need silk, it's right here, right? Um, like mm -hmm. silk for the armors and such. Yep. One moment, please. <laughs> That's only about 30 items in there. Oh, good. <laughs> Just the hardened steel crap, okay. Yeah. So this um... is... Ah, yes, okay, so we're on third... This is the... Third uh, level, so this... Yeah, yeah. We're putting one of these uh, ah. on each level in the center here. This is the treasure, treasure room. Piece. Yes. The pile is too small. All right, we should must get more. larger. Hold on. on the brighter side of things, though, we have thirty-one thousand seven hundred and five point six value, which means we're eligible eligible for the <laughs> largest I level of jumped spirit. up just a bit now because <laughs> he puts the pin. I just put a few more silvers in it. Okay, silvers and golds in it. Ah, actually, that's Oops. quite the chest of of gold. Yeah, and yes, the it's quite a lot. Gems too. Uh, a lot of this came from here? that. Uh, oh yeah. What? Well, that stuff fits in there. Okay, yeah, yeah. What's that from? Like all these like, little. Trinkets? I wouldn't have thought of the tooth necklace and the uh, fossilized bones. Anything bone. that has the treasure tag on them is something oh. that adds value to the coffer. So. Gotcha. We got, a, we got a cool navigation chart in there, and I would love to have that as a uh, placeable, but unfortunately it's mm -hmm. not placeable. It looks so cool, but yeah. Eventually we will get more coin piles and other things, and it'll look really cool. So that's a, that coin pile is an object? Yeah, it just costs a uh, bunch of coins that you could place on oh, the... Oh, really? Uh, okay. Yeah. You, you essentially just transfer the coins, and you could actually talk to the guy, mm -hmm. and you could see that... The coin pile itself is worth 330 because it takes uh, like 300 gold and like 30 silver or something. Or 30, 30 gold and 30 silver. Or Exchange whatever it is. treasure? Uh, or, that's what you do or what? 300. Uh, exchange treasure. If you coins. want, you could make um, you could make gold bars out of gold make, coins. How did you say you make the gold coins? Uh, that's specifically a coin pile. It's made in your uh, building hammer. So you go to treasure, and if you have... Yeah, it takes 300 gold coins and 300 silver coins, and you can make a coin uh, pile. Ah, okay, I'm good to see, yeah. And it's a treasure of that same value, it's just... Yeah, it's the same value, just... It. Yeah. And then there's the For the barracks. unorganized. There's the <clears throat> barracks here. Yep, there's the barracks. Nice. Uh, we need some chairs on this table. Yes, we do. And hot. Oh, which mm -hmm. level is the... Uh, be oh, nice to have a little uh, map or a... Uh, which level is the... A, a little image on? of the teleport table would be awesome. A miniature map room a would be so cool. A miniature map room would be awesome on there. That's what that needs. I like this. The servants' quarters and the... Uh, the commander's... Yeah, and that goes right... And commander's room? You gotta have guards right beside the treasure room, just in case. Gotcha, yeah. On the other side, um, you've entered the servant's quarters. There's also ah, the commander's office here. So we've got a small kitchen in here as well. Um, beds for the servants. And uh, we'll, we'll have a some sort of common area below here. And the probably. hole mm -hmm. leads right to the kitchen. Yep. Right down to the kitchen. Oh, yeah. yeah, we've added a few of those, uh, of those things just for a. Um, it made sense, access. and they've also got a closet. Maybe it'll nice. be a little bathroom instead of yeah, a closet. Maybe, we'll see. except that there aren't any bathroom stuffs. We could put a bucket. There's in also there, no door. A bucket. Yeah, just put a bucket. Yeah, well, I'll figure that out. Uh, what's this? This is the officer's quarter. The officer mess. Right, uh, yeah. yeah. He gets his own bed. He's yeah. got his own bed in here, yeah. The captain of the guard. Ah, uh, yes, yes. Wait, what like is it. that? 
thingy? Is that a... It's, like, it's a Kaitan uh, statue thing. Legionary statue. Oh, yeah. Alright, Father is the captain of the guard. Oh. Can't both sit on it? I tried to. No, I guess not. Oh, yeah, yeah there you go. Thanks, yeah. Luke. And he's got the uh -oh. Are banner. we in disciplinary measures? <laughs> Are we being disciplined? Are you I being know, disciplined? I, I don't I remember didn't... emotes. I don't think I don't you can emote you. while you're sitting. Uh, our... uh, you can't emote while sitting. That's a, that's a shame. <laughs> okay. Uh... <laughs> what? Yes, if you're being disciplined. He did the slitting of the throat. <laughs> the throat. <laughs> Okay. It's the only one I can think good. of that was disciplinary. And... I'll be good. I was trying to use a scared emote, but... <laughs> there was, a, like, a sweat drop or a sweating emote. Yeah, where did the father go? Just like, oh, no. Lost him. There he is. Found him. play with the horn. Where'd you find the horn? In the treasure. Oh, the treasure. Oh yeah, All I right. guess this leads right to the treasure room as well, is the servant's quarters. I completely yeah, forgot yeah. about that. Yeah. You always uh, want your servants, oops, your servants to immediately access the treasures? Yeah, I thought so. Mm -hmm. If sure. they need to help Works. out in some way, uh, then there's the second floor, right? Yep. Oh, I should probably eat. I haven't done that the whole time video. Uh, I just need ambrosia because that's all we have. Because uh, that's what's made in the food thing. If it is in your inventory, and then click on it and consume it. You can write it. Just need to no. find. Let's see if I got food. Yes. Ah, yes. Exotic flesh. Uh, it's the une unready stuff. A hearty stew! Oh, look at that. Mm. Actually, Tasty. here, come back here for a second, Ned. Uh -huh. I forgot about this room here. Oh wait, no, that's that's no. that room. Never mind. Uh, mm -hmm. This room here. Oh no, I have this room. I'm not in this room. I didn't even know we had this room. The alchemist and the oh, dyer. Yeah. Oh yeah, you haven't seen this room? Good, good, good. Yeah. So this is our permanent artisan Casting table here. Alchemy, artisan. Casting. Yeah. Alchemy. Dyer's Carpentry. Dyer's like bench. Carpentry. Yeah. And I think this is where our storage is going. Yes, it is. Uh, the fireball cauldron's absolutely huge. The the next one up, it's either the giant yeah. one or the other one. The one it's that had, even like, bigger than the alchemist bench. Yeah. Um, and reasonable to not have it there. The yeah, improved one fine. still does what we need. So. Mm -hmm. uh, I like it. Floor two. Are is that at? this whole floor? Uh, this yep, that's three. the whole floor there. Ah, uh, uh, this goes out onto the. There's uh, also this little room system. as well. Um, not yet filled. Maybe this we do a pass, like a medic a pass station or to something. The, yeah. Yeah, there's a pass through the guard. We could do a medic station somewhere. A medic station? That sounds cool. I like that idea. I'm not sure if there's downstairs? any medic placeables though. Yes, we could downstairs. do a table and we could just have a thing that's full of health mm. potions and such. Yeah, library is my baby. I haven't finished it it's yet. It's very nice. Thank you. I like the uh, I like the over the gate option. Is that like so... you can stand over top of the outer gate. What are those Here, big like cauldron thingies that you can dump stuff over the? Siege edge? cauldrons. Yeah. Yes, we'll have Siege some. Siege cauldrons. Yeah. <laughs> which actually works in the game, which is I, fantastic. If it's a one tile section, like it, it's not going to block this off, right? Like we'll still have access behind it. No, it it doesn't. You don't stand in it. Like it doesn't stand on here. It attaches here. Okay, so we'll be able to put, like, six siege cauldrons in here. Yeah, I'm not sure their proximity issues, but I know there's, uh, uh I know they, um, uh, they don't block, like, you can walk behind them. They take some of the space here, but... Yeah, like but the intent not, was to have really... a, a two-layer double gate with access yeah. for archers to shoot down, plus siege cauldrons and uh -huh. all the, like... To actually have a functional siege with the castle. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, over here, uh, not really done, but 
temporarily uh, temporary construction. Well, uh, this is our uh, uh, golem work uh, our golem work work area. I golem like crafting. I didn't even know that was an option for a long time. Yeah. And of course, this is on the same level as the garden. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I, I don't think I realized that you can walk through. Oh, yeah, okay, now you did. Yeah. Yeah, nice. And then there's our room, right? Yes, the, so this is the guest room. There's the guest two. rooms. Yeah, that's the guest room. Okay. It's smaller than the others. No guests in there, no rooms. Not yet, at least. No, we haven't done anything with the uh, with the guest room. First door is your room. Yep. Yay! Yeah. So go ahead and uh, design and place things as you wish in here. Nice. Yeah. Got a three I get by a three cubby. for you. I had to put plants to figure out where my room was. Yeah, she got <laughs> lost. I kept getting lost, but this is my room. Ooh. I was gonna say yours is a lot nicer than mine. <laughs> <laughs> so far, yeah. I've got One, two, three, previous four. weapons that I've used, and then there's a little place where you can um, sit and enjoy oh, nice. a place with friends. Ah. Nice. I have been replaced. <laughs> oh yeah, I put a bookshelf in here too, but I haven't done anything with it. And then the chest is all full of. Um, oh crap. Stuff. <laughs> you might want to rebind to that bed. She wasn't bind, bound to her bed in the first place, which is oh. kind of the, the issue right now. How do I unbind from the bed? Uh, you can bind to any oh. bed. Bind to a different yeah. bed so I can bind to I don't have a mine. different bed. There are also some pillows, apparently, you can bind to. This is my room? Okay, how do I make a bed? Somebody get me a bed so I can unbind from her room. Oh. She can't bind there because no, because I'm bound to it. He's bound to it. I just walked up to see if I, I was. I was thinking, oh, I'll just go sit on the bed, and then I realized, oh yeah, that's how you bind them. Okay. I do not recall how to uh, do any of that. So, oh, yeah. somebody, somebody throw uh, a bed down here bed. for me. Uh, There's mean... only one that can be built with the hammer. Oh, yeah. uh, so you'll have a basic bed for now. And then you can, you can choose your bed, your, your other bed Perfect. later. Okay. There are some armor yeah, this is bound that to you. you. That's bound okay. to you. Uh, let me go bind to my bed. There was armor. I, I built it and it auto binds the moment you build it. So. Oh, yeah. Do you see his uh, room? There we go. Not yet, no. Oh, hold on. You bound to your bed? Yep. Yeah. Okay, let me go bind to this one. I could add a couple more there you things go. in here. There you go. Like some you can have your room such. back, Yellow. I just thought it was prettier, yeah. so I would take it. But <laughs> <laughs> um, I gave you some armor earlier that I would like to have back. Oh yes, I've got a I've got a writing desk. I've got a changing, uh, changing and uh, storage corner. Mm -hmm. And uh, I've like got the, the fireplace. As well, or the, the hearth as well. Are you gonna put up some of your old weapons and such? Uh yeah, I'll definitely put up some. Uh, some extra placeables. Where does this lead? That's my closet. Oh, right. You're the one with the walk-in closet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be too jealous. Um, to think I'm the one that's actually closet, collecting different sets of clothing, though. <laughs> I like the uh, big curtain that flops over the door. That's nice. Good touch. Have that armor, please. Yeah, that was originally Ella's idea, and I loved it. So, if you want, you're talking room, to me see... about armor. No, uh, I oh, gave right. Eli Sorry. some armor. Ah, that one. Ah, that one. is there anything else? Um, was there? There's the banners, but banners are your first thing. A scroll through and let me. Apparently, see. I have a person in my pocket. What else is there that you could potentially even just give me? I don't know. All the things. Wait, uh, that one special sword. Oh, yes. Unless Dad wants the light-up sword. No, no. Don't you guys fight it's fine. It. 
It's fine. Oh, I guess. Ooh, look at time. this. Is that nicer than the other one? Look at it. Ah, that's cool. I love the hilt on this. Where'd Dad go? Uh, to get Conroy. Ah. Oh, I am over encumbered. I love the hilt on this sword, though. Yeah, that that looks quite nice on the back. Mm-hmm. Here we go. That's cool. Continue to add to my collection. Oh, I've still got the bell on me. Father back yet? Nope. Went to the wrong floor. <laughs> That's happened many times for me. Nope, uh, went back to the wrong floor. Even in my own way. castle. Yeah, that's that's a normal occurrence at this point. Yeah, that's why Ella started putting flower planners so that she would remember where to find her. Remember so, where stuff is. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm in the treasure room. Next floor. Wait, the is it second floor? Room. Second floor yeah. is rooms, yes. You're on third floor. Ooh, made it. Uh, so yeah, uh, so that's your room. Oh, you're going to place Connery. Right? Maybe. If he'll listen. I don't even see him here. Come on, buddy. He got stuck somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> but he's not far enough away because I'm just vertical from him. He's probably yeah. not far enough away to actually be... You kind of have to point and go, Hey, follow please, buddy. Yeah, I think he got stuck on something on the way. In one of the doors. Oh well. So what am I looking at next? If he's stuck, he's not, he's not getting well, in my way anyways. Uh, this is going to be the throne room. Not even started yet. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, I see. I, you can sit on the thrones apparently. I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah, you can. The uh, ones downstairs, you can. Yeah. Right? So then this here is access to our rooms. Is what this is. Okay. And then there's mm -hmm. also this door, which is the servants' quarters, Oops. all the way through. No, no. Lies. <laughs> I did that last time. The servants will also have a rigorous uh, exercise thing they'll need to follow. Oh, that—that that would be stuck. That would suck. Climbing in the ladder, just the, the door open. You just get <laughs> like an emperor's new groove sort of thing, and <laughs> just get slammed by the door. <laughs> <laughs> You've thrown off the Emperor's Groove. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm I, I mean, like at the end when Yzma's a cat and then Croc just like slams the window no, shutter on her. Right. It was like the same thing. Oh, this there he is. is going to be the armory here. Oh, how'd you go? Oh, hey, Conroy found me. Yep. Hold on. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you coming, buddy? This way. Yeah, I know you're upset. I know. But they gave us a room, so it's all good. Yes, you can even sit on the bed. <laughs> can he? I don't know. <laughs> sword. This sword is really cool. You like the sword, huh? I like it. It fits the my aesthetic yeah, a lot more than the other. It definitely one. fits. So I had a bed. Is okay, but this one is like, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Come on out. I had a bed. What happened? Oh. Yes, <laughs> 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 did put him on uh, top. I think Dad's also going to need a double bed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so this is the armory here. This will be mm -hmm. the armory. And then we've got the rear guard house. Mm -hmm. uh, so that attaches both to the throne room and to the outer wall. Nice. This is the overlooking. Yeah, this is the one that actually goes out to the drop of doom. Mm -hmm. The yeah. most fatal portion of the building project of the original version. Actually, I removed the drop of doom. Oh, oh, you mean the <laughs> trying to build on that edge was the worst. Yeah, I didn't enclose this, so it's no longer a triangle that is insta death for anyone mm -hmm. who falls in. 
Very nice. Oh, right. You Very can't courteously. go through that door because it's the crate. Uh, yeah, that's not, um... It's currently that door not is out of order, right currently. Yes. Castles always have that. Stuff gets shoved in front of the doorway. Uh, so yeah. They Gardos don't use that way. Into the throne room, into the armory. Mm -hmm. uh, the room right beside it, uh, the armory, is the war room. Not sure how we're going to exactly uh, plan like that it. out. But we Planning tables and uh, such. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, yes, we mentioned already the Gollum workshop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's I like it. And then, yeah, this is the this is the library floor, of course, because you want you want the library to be on the same floor as the rooms. Yep. And this is the coziest space in the whole thing. That's yep. the plan. Well, uh, this is that so far. The Arboretum. This is what, yeah, because those are the two places that. Uh, uh, are meant those for are the guests. two places that we started doing actual decorations first. Right? Like, we did our rooms, but then those are the two things we started with. There's a creepy guard outside, by the way. Yes. The one guard that we yeah. were testing through all stuff with. She guards the entire fortress. Single handedly. She'll be getting a promotion out With one point. nothing but the shirt on her back. <laughs> Which is barely does. suitable for the, uh, <laughs> for the weather, but that's oh, yeah. okay. But you have that her skin's iron. You have that spear on you. Can Ooh. I have it? The more to something? I had a couple of those, actually. I, I just want one. Mordlin. Um, this will, like, the library will light up a little bit as well as we put lights in the floors below and above. Mm-hmm. So, uh, like, these wall lanterns are perfect, though. Like, the perfect amount of light for the, uh, for the little table here. Right? I like it. I'm sitting yeah. on a pillow. Hmm? Yeah, you can sit on pillows, and I put stuff more on the tables. The alchemy bottle looks like one of those um, little ink thingies. Mm hmm So, that I works. like it. It's totally yeah, inkwell. Like, the light is just enough for, like, it's it's a perfect amount of light. It's not blinding. Just enough to get blind, to go blind with. Oh, yeah, and there's also these, like, bigger benches, like, for, uh... Mm-hmm. The hope was that you'd be able to put your feet up, or you could sit two people on it. Yeah. But, yeah, that's what we got. Um, it takes a ridiculous copious amount of both time and plant fiber in order to make just a single row of these books. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And yeah. if you take the shelf out, you lose everything on it. Seriously? Yeah, yeah. I've done that multiple times oh, where I've stockpiled lame. resources, I've taken the shelf out, you and can't... I keep trying to figure out why I don't have all my books. You can't even move the bookshelf unless everything is off it. Yeah, it's Whoa. it causes issues. That's, uh, a, that's a crappy deal. Don't don't decide wrong. Yeah, and then you've got Wait, the hanger. footrest. Mm, yeah, because it, it was a small enough table. Uh, it, uh, tables were too big, but the footrest mm -hmm. was big enough to put a plant. And then have it like up it. with the tapestry. Mm -hmm. We originally had the tables, uh, and or the chairs facing the other ways for the tables, and then we realized it's much better if everyone's not looking at each other while they're trying to do study. Correct. Yes. It's all study stuff. Yeah. Someone yeah. brought yeah. a like the, the tables are independently, uh, like different things are happening on the tables. Yeah, that that was Ella just now. Well, Very nice. I, I did the, the scrolls people? here, but Ella did the rest. Yeah, all the candles and the yeah. papers and all that. The one person's just here reading a book and having like a glass of whatever they feel like. One person is doing like alchemy stuff with, on the paper. Another person has multiple books. And then another person is a historian, is what I thought. Mm -hmm. The alchemy decor mm -hmm. bottle is, I assume, the, uh, the ink bottle? Yep. The ink Because it yeah. looks exactly yeah, how it needs to look. Yep. I said it's there for it. We are trying and looking and looking to find an inkwell, and we couldn't find. This works. Yeah, this is great. Okay, uh... Alright. Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's, uh, reading the books. Yeah, just reading books. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> okay, so they'll never find it. Is that everything? Uh, there is one more place. Oh, there's one more. Uh, yeah, what, what place we missed? Which place mm -hmm. is that? Except, uh, they haven't seen that place. Yes. But the rest happened. Or at least, mostly. Oh, it's the... the under. Oh, right. So, of course, the one thing we don't have, is apart from animals, is... Amazon workers. I mean, employees. <laughs> I mean... Uh... <laughs> yeah, uh, this is our uh, uh, greater wheel of pain. It fits in here. The whole building was, this whole tower was actually designed for the Greater Wheel of Pain. Uh, both the, yes, the, actually, specifically for the map room, up, up at the top, <clears throat> but also for the Greater Wheel of Pain in the basement. So, yeah, it needed to yeah. be able to fit both, but. Yeah, so, uh, in order to have the, um, yeah, the pillars in the right places, you needed to have, uh, yeah, it has to actually go through the Greater Wheel of Pain. That was a, uh. That was a struggle of getting that. Uh, we also have a place below the Greater Wheel of Pain. <gasps> Whoa. The spot for the really, really bad folk. Ones that no longer the deserve dungeon? to be on the, wheel, on the Wheel of Pain. Is this the dungeon? Is this the dungeon? Yeah, probably. Oh, this whole thing's the dungeon. But, like, the dungeon for holding people like that. Which we could technically the put trolls in there. <laughs> uh, come here, father. Mm -hmm. I think it is time to reveal this, the secret that I've been keeping all this time. Uh oh. I'm right here. Okay. Click on this. <gasps> it is the secret. A secret the running tunnel. tunnel. Yeah, exactly. It's for his, it's for his, his private exercise room. <laughs> uh, this the... is the tunnel going straight from the dungeon into the wine cellar, which is going to be in here. This whole large area here. What the heck? This could be like an insane bunker. There's a ladder here? Yeah. Yeah, there is. Because you know where else it goes? But the wine cellar's got to attach to the tavern, right? And, where? you know where else it needs to attach to? Where? My bedroom. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> so, uh, take, take a step back here, guys. <gasps> Where's here? Oh, whoa! Yeah. Are you just oh, gonna leave this curtain, open now right? for now? Yeah, there's, we're gonna have a curtain over top. And, yeah, we're gonna hide it. I forgot about the curtain, yeah. I don't remember how I did it, but I'll have to, uh, I'll have to remember. <laughs> um, so, yeah, and then we also can have this door. Can you walk through the curtain? I you don't can't. think so, no. Um, I forget how I did it. I'll have to, I'll have to figure it out again. And there's another place here. We do have another place here. Um, this doesn't actually lead anything to anything. I, uh, this is actually an just, extra void space. Uh, it's an extra void space it's for the cheese storage whatever room. we might need. Cheese. So you gotta keep your cheese. So I, I do, this how I get around the castle. Yeah, monkey bars. To be extra, to be extra oh. strong. So is this leading to your room then? Uh, this no. Uh, this is, uh, this is an extra, um, extra cavity here. It's the weight room. Where's your it's room? It's the training room. Uh, where's my room? Um, it's still hidden. Oh. That's why I needed this little, uh, corner here. I haven't figured out how I'm going to, uh, incorporate it yet, but... Uh, uh, change room, he says. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let me change. Places in the castle, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So. Dang. You, you could just, just put a fake... trap door there and then just uh, not open it. Can you put a trap door and put a mat over it? Over I it? think I can. And I'm going to do that. That'd That's be best. Like so a, cool. a, 
Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, I wanted to show there's you a, guys there's a, there's a creaky, if you jump just the right spot, it makes a creaking sound. It lets you know which one is the secret entrance. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's the secret that goes all the way through the castle. That's where it ends. Fantastic. Is this your a way to get out of the castle if, say, there was an attack and you had to leave? <laughs> yeah, it leaves you at the other end. There isn't actually an exit to the outside. No, but it does but, lead you, know. you enough that you could just sneak to the front of the castle and leave. You could totally, you could totally use it to escape, yeah. Yeah. Uh, every every royal chamber needs a uh, needs a secret escape plan. And I guess mm -hmm. you're the one who gets to escape because the rest of us can't. Well, you guys, you guys can enter my room if you need to. I guess, yeah. Your room is the farthest to get into. So you have to go through multiple doors for it. Yeah. Well, if they're if they're if they're block breaking down this door, uh, yeah. father heads out, goes through this door, closes it, right? Oh, if they Bars if I it. have if I'm the only one with plants in front of mine, they would probably assume that mine. They'd probably go for my room instead of yours. Ah, I, I don't know about that. Well, if it maybe. looks like it's a more decorated and important room, they'd probably go for that. All right, I'm putting a plant in front of my room now. <laughs> Do you want people to go for your room? No, I'm joking. Um, we'll find a different plant. And so yeah, we've got that whole uh, access from the tavern as well. That was my. Um, ultimate secret room uh, back when we first built the castle and it's it it's ex it's grown it's expanded it's improved <laughs> you mentioned more more having so. one and then I bet I completely forgot about it and then you just didn't say anything no I gotta I, I had to keep it secret even from me well I I, I showed you I did show you the room but... I don't remember you showed me Super tough secret to keep from her. Just mention it once and forget about it. He mentioned that it way. I'm not first. keeping a secret. If she forgets, it's her problem. He mentioned something at the very start, and that was it. Um, I made it originally so that I don't exactly remember how I hid it, but it was something to do with a. Was it a box or something that I put in front, and then I would just like shuffle the box over and then crouch behind? Was it a cupboard that I put behind it? The I old think... one? Yeah, the old one. Was it a cupboard and a tapestry? It was a cupboard. Yeah. Yeah, I think it was a cupboard and a tapestry that I used to uh, to cover it. It was a. It was an actual like cupboard, and then you just moved it. Like it was one of those like pull on the book. And it yeah. slides open. Yes, yeah, so that was it. Right, well, I'm going to uh, uh, end my uh, visit there. That is fantasticer than I expected to see. <laughs> you could put a curtain and then the cupboard. Yeah, yeah. So, I, yeah, I put a tapestry in my, the my uh, cupboard. I think my three favorite things are the, uh, yeah, yeah, tapestry on top of the cupboard. I think my feet, three favorite things are the uh, um, the the super secret hole in the ground. That's awesome. Um, you just fill fill the top with cups. Um, of the <laughs> cupboard. Oh, we've got a tapestry um, put behind it too. So third place has got to be the touch. the hidey hole underneath. And second place is probably the uh, arbory, arboreum or whatever it is, the, the, the plant space. That looks really impressive. The garden? But definitely not the I'm garden sure thing, switch. yeah. Not not the, like, guard where the planters are, but the one with, like, the the arched, uh, the arched flowers and yeah. stuff. That room. I guess it's kind of a couple rooms, but... <clears throat> and the definitely the... the Creme de la creme is the library, so. Yay! It is a fantastic. This right that you're that spot. I'm, I'm looking at the stream on the other page. That uh, um, weirdly angular spot behind the or under the uh, yeah thing was originally going to be our treasure room. Ah yes. Remember, because yeah. there was no treasure room. There was no treasure mechanic in the game at the time. 
And yep. that was supposed to be our treasure room. And it was smaller, slightly smaller than the one that's there. It was much smaller. Yeah. I expanded oh, yeah, this dramatically. Yeah. Like, it the was design a moved, quarter of the size. Because we placed, we placed the castle. Yep. We intentionally placed the castle to be well, bigger, to have more room. And uh, and I spent a lot of time just trying to, um, trying to figure out where I could put the places. Because the issue is, right, we're right beside the Temple of Frost. The reason why the castle's the shape that it is is because the Temple of Frost actually cuts it, cuts a uh, chunk out of uh, where the castle could be. Yeah, uh, in between right. the bulk, we're literally pinned like one block is from the one block either way. We would one block one way we'd be in the temp too close to the Temple of Frost. The other block the another block the other way would be too uh, close to the volcano. Actually, we had to cheat a the little front bit. Gate minus ten percent. Uh, we we. Like, we're 10% over that line. There were two specific um, fence, like, fence pieces, like, wall, uh, exterior fence wall pieces that we put on the top of the tower uh, that we had to place specifically in the, um, in the you can build anywhere zone mode. Uh, it tra changed it in the admin settings just so that we could put those two pieces. No. Oh. Uh, because, uh, because we were just, outside. yeah. We we Roger, built it literally yeah. so close that we couldn't build it any closer. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I, I want I, I spent a lot of extra time on this room because uh, of course we're um, we we're originally planning out the the foundation and I had planned this and uh, like the walls are slightly weaker in this place, mm -hmm. uh, like only slightly. Well, right? yeah, you can see yeah, that there's. Uh... Only in 89 certain places. meters up on the castle wall is the, the the is where the defense needs to be the best, right? Whoops, that's that's gonna be an issue. Uh, right. That wasn't the place. I'm gonna have to uh, fix this, which is going to cause a lot of issues later. Whoops, I was trying to show you Did something. You move but something? yeah, uh, there there were certain things in these corners, like um, a lot of these corners um, are are almost open to the air, but because we are able to stack um, wall, like wall uh, foundation wall we're able to use the overlay from the wall pieces themselves to actually fit in between and block the light that would come through th uh, with two foundations in between. Mm -hmm. And then we actually a have like, between them. quite a large area. Um, this was uh, this little tunnel is actually because uh, we had a full extra space uh, because of the way that the, the mountain started tapering off. So we mm -hmm. had just an extra row because this is in line right here. Uh, like, we are literally directly under the stage is what this is. Yep. Right. So, so yeah. Uh, yeah. And then... Yeah, I put the uh, the exit to be um, in the uh, yeah in the uh, what's this place again? Torture chamber? Uh, dungeon? Because Dad and I were talking, it's like oh, it'd, be, it'd be cool to have a uh, a place where it's like oh we could break through here, we could get away, and then it's like oh wait, this doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> but uh, but yeah. I wanted the secret rooms because what is a castle without a couple secrets? Exactly. Yeah. Good on. Well, that was an awesome tour, guys. Thank you so much. Yeah. Great work. I will uh, have to have a look again when there's a bunch of new, uh, new decor things. More aesthetics. I might need to uh, uh, modify the uh, stream name this time because uh, spent a lot on the castle tour and we didn't end up getting to the couple things that we had in mind. But yeah, did none of those things, but that's okay. We did, however, unlock the ability to make these banners, which uh, mm -hmm. is going to be quite nice because uh, yeah, we'll we'll put those in along the walls. We can do that definitely before we leave. 
Mm -hmm. uh, well, I'm going to say goodnight for now, yeah. and you guys uh, enjoy the finish. And uh, thanks, everybody, for uh, helping me out with the tour for me. Yeah. Honestly. And if you're still there, good night, old man <laughs> young. Yes. I've been wanting to do a tour for Thank a very James. long time now. Uh, I'm glad we were able to uh, go ahead and do one. Mm hmm. Alrighty, enjoy the wrap-up, and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you very much, Father. Bye. Hopefully Bye. we'll see you again another another time. You gotta you gotta mm. still decorate your room. <laughs> I must I must do. Yep. Have a good night, guys. Good night. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and put these banners up. How many do we oh, need? I still have this bell. Still have that bell? It has a use button on it. Oh. Here, I'll come to you and, and we'll find huh? out what it is. Yeah. I'll come to you and we'll uh, How many of the Heirs of the North banners do you get? did you get? Uh, Heirs of the North? I gave them to you, I'm pretty sure. Or I put them in the thing. Uh, the dark mode? I gave you the banners, did I not? You gave me the other ones. Yeah, not the Heirs of the North one. You gave me the... Oh! Um, what you call it? Oh, I got the siege cauldrons. Ten of them. The I don't heirs to the north. Uh, I don't. I don't. I didn't forgotten have those. Forgotten clan. I gave you forgotten clan. I don't have any. Um, heirs. Oh, really? Them. I thought we found a bunch in the in the place. No, we found where to make. Okay. Uh, do you want me to do the bell? Yeah. Sure. Go ahead. Okay. Ah. I got a special thing. You want to place it? Go ahead and place it. What is it? I don't know. Is that animal stuffs? It looks like animal stuff. Harkadam, okay. huh? Ah. No, it's just a little structure, huh? Cool. I guess it's something that you can attach to your home and it'll be a little place for the animals. I guess so. That's what it looks like. Wow, that I'll have to use it when I do my animal stuff. You sure we didn't get any Heirs of the North stuff? I'm pretty sure we didn't. Thought I got something, but I wasn't seeing it in my inventory. I'll have to look closer. Curtains. Where do we build the banners? Oh, uh, there's the Forgotten Clans banner. A blade that weighs nothing. No kidding, that is a very light blade. 0 0.1. <laughs> oh, there it is. How many did you want? Well, uh, we'll probably want two more. My question is... We've got these Forgotten Clan banners, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put one on. We gotta see how it looks, right? Mm -hmm. And, uh... We have to decide what kind of orientation we're gonna put them in. I kinda like having them come out. Oh, it is still, uh, ripped up there, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Do we want to keep any of those banners? I kind of like them, still. I'd say they we, are good. We can keep them. I'd say we keep them for now, and then if for fun, and then we look for a different banner that we would want. Okay. In its place, potentially. My question then is. Or we could use them outside the castle. We're gonna put four on each side, one adjacent from each of the pillars, right? Yes. My question is, what orientation should they be in? Heirs of the North, then the other one, then Heirs of the North, then the other one? Uh, I kind of feel like Heirs of the North should be both on the outside, and you have two inside ones that are the same. Or the Heirs of the North both here, and then the other two mm. large ones over there? No. Heirs of the North on the outsides, and the other two on the inside. Ah. Uh... Okay. So then when you walk in, you have heirs of the north, which is kind of what we are. 
And then when you... And also, Heirs of the North is going to be related to Ymir, which we're going to put the, right beside the Ymir shrines. Yeah, and the Ymir shrines are the furthest away. So you put one over here, and then you put one kind of over here, and then you have the other two in the middle. I think it... Okay, you, you go ahead and... Here, I'll give you... I don't want to place them right now. Why not? Because uh, I They're am easy. really bad at that. No, these are these ones are actually pretty easy to place. You go ahead and take those, and there's the north banners as well. Uh, they're they're, they're in here. Uh, you go ahead and uh, put them in your orientation. I'm gonna go ahead and I, I want to see the difference of these. I'm gonna put this one down, and then I'm going to go ahead and put a couple more benches. And then when you're done, we can compare the two designs and. We'll see which one we like best. Sound good? Okay. I can't see how I'm placing them. How can you see? Uh, if you look directly at the wall, you can assume... Uh, you might want to go into first-person mode for it. But if I you look... I can't even see the flag, so I don't know. Yeah. I'm having a re um, really If you look... Um, the flag will point towards you, so you, then you just put it against the wall. You don't need to spin it or anything. As long as you're square with the wall, it should face straight. No, it's saying it doesn't even have contact with the ground. Uh, don't try moving it then. Try just placing it. Pillar, along with pillar. Here. So, yeah, uh, you just... And it's not doing that. Here. It's not doing that for me. Understand, it's not. Not take out the wall. Um, across from this pillar, you're looking at the middle of this pile. Yeah, they should be in the middle, not between the, uh, not between the two squares. Yeah, this one is saying not enough contact to the ground, huh? Yeah. Specifically this one. Again. Yeah, that's that's weird. Might be an issue with this spot directly. Okay, I'm gonna go try putting a couple benches in here. Sorry, this is bad matters, but I'm standing on the table. It just does not want to place. But this is kind of what I had in mind. You've got our main banner, two secondary banners, and then another main banner. The other one is what I was thinking. I kind of like mine more. Because then you go short, too long, and then short again. This one kind of looks or feels like you're being, like, papered in or drawn into the room, but... Yes. Uh, you, you, it's your castle, you pick. 
my decision. It's your castle. I feel like separating them's a little bit, a little bit weird. Yeah, I guess. Um, like, I do like the idea of putting both of the heirs of the north banners so that this feels like a Ymir area, like this corner, right? If we go with these banners specifically, though, they've got mammoths, <coughs> them, which kind of is also like yeah, heirs of like the north. It, it does fit. Like, it's not Sumerian, it's... Even though you, I guess, are Sumerian. It's fine. Um, I'm just saying, this isn't directly Sumerian. Um, it's actually the Forgotten Clan banner. Well, Sumerian, I feel like, would be, like, desert person. No, Sumerians is the people in the, uh... Mounds of the Dead. That's their main... That's their main place. Oh. I thought that was either the desert or Zelha. Uh, no, that's their mammoth. Oh, I guess... Yeah, I guess that is them, them, them the mammoth. Symbols. Mm -hmm. Symbolism. Uh, but yeah. Uh, that, that's their, that's their capital. The Mounds of the Dead. Then, of course, you've got Dogs of the Desert and the Den. You've got, um, you know, Azagarth is Ymir. The or the, the Nordheimers. Um, Supremaru is the Relic Hunter City. Uh, this is a castle. I don't know if that's a capital for anyone. Uh, summoning place is the Tafari capital. And then Zelha is the Lemurian capital, even though there's literally a single Lemurian camp. The Black Hand with the Black Galleon. Black Hand and the Black Galleon, yeah. Is there anyone for the Volcano? There's a lot of different mixes of races in the volcano. Okay, what's the Temple of Frost as well? That's also Ymir. That's Frost Giants mostly, but... Mm. Yeah, like, Outcast Camp is Frost Giants. So I guess that's the Frost Giant capital. Okay. To be fair, they would be the only ones to be able to live there. Effectively. This is true. Uh, oh, right oh, oh sorry them. for the uh, whiplash there, everyone. <laughs> All right. Thank, Thank you, Father, for the encouragement. Definitely uh, glad to have you in the game for uh, first time in a while. Yeah. Uh, it's it's really nice. We've never gotten to the castle like that that we were building years ago. We never got it quite to this spot. Um, like we we had our we had rooms done, but it wasn't feeling nearly as homey as this one now does. It wasn't as decorated. No, it wasn't quite as decorated. Like I did a I did a great job in the tavern. Um, oh, by the way, the kitchen was tiny. The kitchen fit in a uh, single hexagon. Oh. Like the kitchen was tiny, tiny. That's why we were having so much extra room uh, below the kitchen, because below the kitchen is the uh, is the secret area, mm. the underground cellar. Uh, but yeah, like look at all that extra space. It looks good. It looks really good. Um, yeah, like it was really hard to fit everything in there, and honestly, I am so happy with how it's been turning out. I, I had the blueprints. Like, I, I had made blueprints for this castle. I had had the blueprints, and I... Um... Like, I found the blueprint only of... Was the first floor that I had the blueprint for? Uh, yes. Yeah, yes. I think... It, yeah, it must have been, right? Yes, it was. And, uh... Yeah, that was... It was... Um bit of a challenge to recreate, but, like, I managed to somehow, like, I was going ahead and trying different things in a creative mode to see exactly where I could fit, um, the various, um, like, exactly what kind of grid that I could use so I could know what size the castle could be at its maximum size. <laughs> I, I, I maximized the castle, like, it's another two wide. 
And I think it's another one or two long or more. You made a new blueprint for this one. I, remember. I, I did. I did. I had to make a new blueprint and... Uh, and it, it worked well. I more made half of a blueprint and then I got to the where it's supposed to be tapering off. And I'm like, I gotta go into the game now. Because I've got no idea how this is supposed to work. <laughs> is that an adequate enough space? Yeah, it is. Yeah, uh, it's 11. It is 11. All right, well, I'm going to at least put the benches in. <laughs> yeah, things are looking good. We'll need another deer head to fit, or another elk head to finish the upstairs wall. Yeah, the benches don't exactly fit perfectly, but... It's fine. People got up and they pushed the benches back. You just gotta do the church pew shuffle. Or church pew shuffle is what you gotta do to uh, to get through the... Uh, if people the... are going to eat food and sit on the bench, they push the benches back to get out. So this is just an after meal. That's why I didn't put as many plates, because there's just stragglers. Uh, I see. So it makes sense, lore-wise. I'm not going to worry about the position of the benches because I feel like they would be in the in different positions where the tables would be like, we're nailing this to the floor. Yeah. <laughs> sort of thing, right? Tables are one thing, benches are another. It's okay if the benches aren't perfect. Yo, that's pretty good. I sent some benches. How many do we need? One. Three. Five, seven. Seven benches. You're missing one on this side. This one here. I am. Okay, I will get eight benches. Oh, yeah. I need to find the right benches, because the last ones were terrible. Oh, yes. And, uh, for right there, for, oh, and I mentioned my kitty. This is Lotus. They're my, they're my Black Panther. They're yes. My level 10 Black Panther. I think the Lotus is probably the highest level. Yeah, it's I yeah. have not leveled up my animals. They got animals. their first perk. I'm tempted instead of Saber. Like, Saber Cat's my favorite animal in the game. I do have uh, honestly, I and probably. Silver here, so... Like, Saber Cats tempt me. The White Tigers tempt me. Lions are one of my favorite animals, but they don't look the best in this game. Like, that's a pretty slim tiger. So what would you want, then, if, you, if you're if you tempted, but haven't really... I, like, I'm tempted to have a white tiger, because they look really cool, when you but have, I'd go with the sabers. You can rename Shira to whatever you... When you go to use Shira. Maybe or you I'll, can use Silver, because Silver's silver. a cool name. Oh, yes, and then there's the two wolves at the front. I I, oh, right. Uh, what were the wolves? They're names? Grim and Reaper. Grim and Reaper, so yes. So that, it, it's like you have bodyguards and their names go together. <laughs> yes. The two people looking out at the, uh, at the end. Yeah. So, that, that was the idea. Hmm. Wow, I can actually walk through here. Yeah, it, that's the closest we can get to the wall which is uh, odd what do we have on the other side here is that causing an issue potentially is that right where the uh, railing for the stairs is I don't know but I'm going to go ahead and uh... see if I can remove this and then maybe put it back Maybe it'll work. I can't exactly do the uh, Minecraft jump in place, huh? No, you can't. Not in this game. No. What's the matter with this? Huh? 
Not enough contact with the ground. What do we gotta put it direct? What if it just has It doesn't have to be attached directly to the ground, does it? Maybe. Maybe that's the that maybe that's the issue. So then would you put a foundation there? Oh that's what it is, Ella. It's a double foundation. See that? Oh, it didn't have a foundation there. Oh, green for a moment there. Yeah, it's just the foundation. That's the place it needs to be built. Yeah, that's awkward. So then, what happens if you put a foundation? There. Can't put foundation inside of it, unfortunately. Oh, well, take the banner out and put a foundation on top of that tile. Are you not able to? Here. Yeah. I think the issue is that it's not enough contact to the ground. That, um, like mm. here, you get actually close enough to the ground. Here is actually decently far away from the ground. Oh. Um, the weirder part is this is directly on top of the tunnel. And what if you didn't use a foundation and you used a different one? What if I did that differently, huh? I, I had thought that might have worked because on the other side, that's really all it is. It's just a wall and then, right? Yeah. Uh, cause that, that's how I made it, or that's how I stacked things underneath the foundations, oh. huh? right? Mm -hmm. Like if you take a look, make sure I've got the right place. That's not the one. I hit it. Uh, I hit it decently. There it is. Right, like, the only way I was able to do this was uh, specifically because you put a um, ceiling and then you're able to put foundation on top of the ceiling. Mm. Because you can't stack um, foundation, um, right, like you can't have something under a foundation. Foundation's supposed to touch the ground. But you can put it on ceilings. So that's the little uh, cheat code that I made to use the entire uh, the entire hidden section of the castle. Can I ask when you worked on this? Was this like after stream when I was already off and gone? Uh, yeah, usually it was after stream when everyone was off. I would spend a couple hours working on it. Is that why you were on the game during those times? Yeah, usually. I thought you were just trying to do stream stuff. Well, I was. I was trying to plan the floor plan of uh, all the foundations, right? So then you were just making your thing at the same time. So I was making it at the same time, so that way it was built literally into the foundation. So, um, yeah, it was, it was purpose-built. Alright. Yes. Some of the things I had to change and uh, remodel... Um, like, I did also a little bit of cheating here, just to make this a little bit more symmetrical. Um. I think. Yeah. In order to have this walk around, uh, this two tile isn't here. Up on the top floor. Oh. You see that? Oh, yeah. It's one tile, and then it goes out, because that's the castle wall. Mm -hmm. But in order to have the walk around, I just did the same method. Right? Yeah. So. It's cool. Where are those benches? How to make them? Oh, yeah. right. They're, I made them right? Yeah. Oh, you 
placing them in that ending stream, or are you... Yeah, I'm just gonna finish off with the benches. And, uh, now I've gotta go make a new thumbnail. <laughs> what, would, what would it even be? A castle tour? Yes. I'll need to look at the... You wanna, you wanna actually go ahead, you have the stream open. Uh, can you figure out at what time we started the castle tour? So I can put a timestamp in the, in the description there? Yeah. That would be helpful. There is a reason why I did not want to drop Conan as a game, even though we had done a lot of stuff with it, and it was starting to get a little bit bored with it, and then we... Because, like, oh, well, we're just doing one more room in the castle. The Emberlight mod really spruced it up a lot. Like, it gave a lot of... Um, a lot of life and a lot of flavor into the, uh, into the castle. Like, literally, the two... Um, rooms that my dad's like, oh, these are my favorite rooms. These are the best rooms. Are was the rooms that we've spent the most time on. Well, yes. Like we've we've done like a couple stream, like the few past streams on those rooms specifically, right? Mm -hmm. Like d we did the garden, we did the arbor, we did uh, multiple streams in the library, right? Yes. And uh, like, sure, we spent the most time, but like those are actually. Specifically from the Emberlight mod. Right? Mm -hmm. Um, and I will say that I personally like my arbor um, better than your garden, but the garden's only half finished, so... I also came up with the idea of putting those two smaller ones inside the big one. Yes, that was very nice. Yeah. You didn't like it at first. You you told me it was too much at first, and then it grew on you. It, it did. It, it did. It grew on you. It's like every time we get a haircut, it's like, I don't like this. And then it grew on... <laughs> I give up. <laughs> I'm here trying to make a pun and a joke about plants, and you're like, oh, plants? Hair. <laughs> uh, to be fair, though, I only found that as I was saying it. I... I was actually being serious there. Like, every time I go get a haircut, it's like, I don't think I like this. And then it takes a little while, it grows in, and it looks... I, I like it. It looks much better. Okay, that's a lot of the tools. Um, I will have to find it as soon as the stream ends, because the times keep changing. Because what? Because my, my phone is being weird, and the times aren't proper. Timestamps aren't proper, so I'll look at it up. Oh, because it's saying minus instead of... Yeah, and I can't change it to the other one. Yeah, that you're not going to be able to get that. Alright, okay. I'll have to look at it later then. Yeah, Once it posts. It looks really good. It looks functional. And it's great how every time we go to actually... Um, decorate something it's like oh we actually look at like realistically how something would be do we have to get rid of a banner i think so do we go with the two and then the one do we go with the one and then the two oh uh, one and then the two so i'd say two do two north banners one blue banner at least for now um, if we get it, if we figure it out, if we get it to work, then we'll definitely swap it. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's like, every time we go to look at the castle, though, it's like, realistically, how would someone do this in real life? Like, this isn't a real-life practical castle, but... No, but we base it kind of off of, like, well, this makes sense, like, where rooms are placed and such. It's like, oh, well, you want the guards kind of surrounding the treasure room. Yeah. So we've got guard barracks like, and servant you've got a... and such on each side. The thing I like about, like, the throne room um, is, even though we haven't done it yet, the idea is um, I shaped it like a mushroom. Um, because, like, right, like, you're in the, you're in the kitchen right now, and I can, I could show by the purposes of the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Right? You've got, uh, 
that threw me off. I thought this is the end and not the other one. <laughs> right? But you've got the three lined hallway. Then you've got this is probably one further in. But you've got if you've got the thrones in here, you can see this area and this area, right? Yes. But so people but but the other ones that are in front of you approaching the throne cannot see it, right? Mm -hmm. So if you need, you can have someone flag you down, give you a message without anyone else noticing. Right? So that was the that was the inspiration behind that. Oh, yeah. I thought it was because you could hide guards there, so if things start getting bad, but then you too. have the person to come right? and arrest them or something. Like, you've got guards from both thought both sides. You can have guards going into the th into the throne room to block off any intruder that might be coming to assassinate me. And they're immediately <laughs> there. Yeah. Oh, hello. I'm just it's another Kinscrew statue. Why don't you put that up? <laughs> You've got your helmet off, so you're not exactly kinscrewed right now. <laughs> you just did the Superman pose. <laughs> I just watched that, and you did the Superman pose. Oh, that that's creepy. Uh, I cannot see your face. You're a little short. I'm being blocked by the horn. <laughs> I know, you're a little short. <laughs> but also, my face is just really dark. Am I taller than you? I, yeah, I made my character. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly yep. what I saw, too. Yep. I might be slight... Yeah, I think I'm slightly taller. I made my character a little bit shorter, so... Not me short, but, like... I'm the only sure. thing I don't like with this hairstyle is that I'm constantly being impaled through the neck with my hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, I guess you've got the high ponytail, I've got the braid. Yeah. I hope that looked cool, though. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You two place your tables or your uh, benches. Yeah, I place the benches. Oh no. Uh, okay. I, I didn't think about that. You place some of them the right way and some of them the wrong way. Yep. All right. You wanna... No. Okay. No! No! Why? Alright, you could go ahead and log it's, yourself it, off. It's 11.17. I got, I got work tomorrow. I actually have to go ahead and... Oh, I, I have work tomorrow, too. Alright. I've got a couple things to Ooh. tweak. I'll make a note of that. Uh, for example, I might need to... Uh, cause some havoc. Why? Um, because there is a... Oh, also, Ella, it's... it's You can have these locked as well, so it's locked hatches. Yeah. So, I, right? So that way you oh. don't have, like, the... A random person just falling through and finding your uh, tunnel. The slave driver can go ahead and help himself to the wine cellar, but he can't get into the rest of the, ta rest of the castle without going through everything else, right? Mm-hmm. Um, uh, but the, uh, the ugly part is this needs to get removed. This might cause issues. Oh, yeah. Ta-da! Issue. Something caused. Oh, so, yeah. That has to be removed. That has to be removed. Actually, no. That didn't have to be removed. No, I think it would just be the stuff downwards there, would it not? Okay. Um. This sometimes doesn't like changing. There we go. And locked out. Time to go upstairs. It took a good while to figure out how I was going to get this to work. Um, and then I realized I could use ladders. Ladders are much more um, space friendly. I had stairs earlier and it just didn't work with the spacing. Mm. Like in, in the previous castle, I actually managed to glitch some pairs of stairs together. And that's the, like on triangles. Oh, yeah. And that's the only way it was able to work. Oh, right. Um... I need to oh. head outside the castle, huh? 
think I can go outside the castle this way. Yes, I can. I'm just going to patch this uh, hole up. I was trying to make a point, and now I regret it, but that's okay. So now, we have this. So, ow, spikes. Yes, it was very fun. It's nice having that back. Yeah, yes, it was very nice having uh, my father join join us. Hopefully, we're almost done. The uh, next time he joins, so we have lots more to show. Okay. Uh, then we did walls. Yes, we did. And was more of the fences. I wanted to grab this piece, put that up there, and then it was just foundations from there. I think so. Yeah. Uh. Ow. Oh. You've got spikes on top of that. Yeah, I tried to go close enough and then fall on top of it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then it's foundation. two foundations. Those are just straight up foundations. Okay. I want the square ones. Thanks. Uh, those are walls. Foundations. Apparently occupied. You should be able to just climb up to the top and finish it. Uh, that... That is smart. Thank you. This is why I keep you around. <laughs> uh, I'd like to okay, think there we go. that I'm kept around for more than just my common hey. sense house. So. Yes, yeah, this is true. Um oh yeah, I needed or I had to do a little bit of cheating over here as well. What? Um oh. specifically oh. down here. Oh. You see these? Yeah. Those are walls. Uh, some of them are walls when they're not supposed to be walls, following a completely different pattern. Ow. Oh, yeah. Uh, if I can go over here. Ow. Uh, so... Actually, no. What I did was I completely redid the castle. The outside of the castle. In order to keep the same pattern running around it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that, that took a bit of effort. It definitely, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I... I... Um, in order to have um, secrecy to make sure there's no gaps between the castles... Or the castle... Uh, the, the foundations, right? Mm -hmm. Because usually if you put a angle with um, three foundations, one, the foundation behind is covering the rest of them, right? Yeah. But we wanted to do wall, foundation, wall, um, and that way we could cover it up, and then also remove the foundations and the walls behind them in order to have a little bit of extra room. Right? Mm -hmm. So, can't exactly go into first person mode in this, but... Um, specifically around here, uh, this floor and this floor, that's where we got all that extra room, right? Yeah. Uh, those, those two dead spaces that I was mentioning? Yes. It's, it's because I just added them in there. Uh, because I could. And, alright. Anyways, we'll wrap up, we'll wrap up the stream now. Um, uh, yep, that was a good, good sized three hour stream. Uh, since I've been a little bit late uh, the past few times. Uh, I'll work on that. Uh, what is that? Oh, yes. Um, uh, because of the shape of the mountain um, and because I wanted a little bit extra space in my room, I, uh, I expanded um, instead of doing the regular pattern with the wall. I instead put a balcony over there. Oh, right. Um, so that they could walk 
along the top of the wall. And uh, that way we didn't have to, uh, well... <laughs> I love that there's yeah. just the windows to my bedroom there. Yeah. Honestly, I should I should do the same. I should put in a couple windows. <gasps> yeah, th thank you both James and, uh, and Brett. Mr. Young and <laughs> Brett. <laughs> Uh, both of you, uh, a pleasure having you. Glad we were able to show off the castle today. And if you came here for the tavern, if you came here for the, uh, uh, for the first floor of the tower, we'll have to finish that off next time. Uh, but I'm so glad that we were able to get that tour. I had a lot of fun with it, and it's so nice getting a progress update. It's looking great, and I'm super pumped about it. It looks great. You're doing a good job. You're doing an incredible job. All your decorating, <laughs> like that that's what's uh that's what's praiseworthy around here. <laughs> I might have made the floor plan, but uh, you made it feel like home. Well done. I I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I can be good at flattery when I want to be. <laughs> I'm just not used to getting flattery in general. Ah, dang it, get it pick up my game. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all for joining us for today. Uh, a pleasure. We'll see you next week for the setting up the tavern, setting up the uh, yeah, the above the kitchen and the tavern as well as the first floor of the tower and then we'll keep going and we'll go up to the second floor and probably do the um, basement dungeon last yeah, I think so. Hopefully by the time we get to the second floor, the library will be at least clo almost done. <laughs> Honestly, I think we just need some more resources in there, right? Yeah. Like a bunch of more books and uh, scrolls. Yeah, but the thing is, I usually go with each shelf and each shelf and determine exactly what kind of thing it's, I want with it. I I spent a lot of time placing uh, random random folding screens, placing some shelves. And I didn't do a lot that stream. I'm glad I took a, uh, took my hands off of it because it turned out incredible. Thank you. Although I did like my ideas about the the central little tables. Yes, you did the tables. I did the central then, tables. Like, you did the central tables, yes, which definitely made things nice and feel like a, a library uh, that you could all study I in. All I knew is that I wanted a place where you would typically go to do some homework, right? Yeah. Like, we, we've had our school libraries, right? You've always got a table in the library that you could sit down and that you could do a little bit of work, right? Yes. And that's what I wanted in our library. I wanted it to feel cozy, and yeah, it's 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 great. Yep. Anyways, yeah, thank you once again, James and Brett, and anyone who else, uh, any else who uh, popped into the, ch into the stream, thanks for joining us. Uh, of course, don't feel, fr feel shy to uh, say hi in chat. Always love the uh, seeing the new faces and knowing who's watching, and we will see you guys all next week. We do also have streams both, well, we got Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Central Standard Time. We've got Skyrim on Mondays, Conan on Wednesdays, and For the King 2 on Fridays, and that's also where you'll find both Ella, my dad, and myself playing some For the King 2 as a, as a party. We're currently on... Chapter 4. Chapter four. We're about what two thirds of the way through. Uh, yeah. So probably one more stream, and that, and then we'll be finished. Probably. As long as we don't get another six percent chance of death and have to redo the entire thing. To be fair, we didn't need to roll that six percent chance of death. It just, it happened. Uh, it happened. <laughs> yeah. Yikes. Six percent chance party death. My dad thought it was an event that uh, was um, mandatory. So he went and just went for it, and that 6% chance literally ended the entire campaign for us. But yeah, we'll be there for more For the King, and uh, keep an eye out for um, any Skyrim videos that I might be posting. Um, I don't know if I'll be doing any more um, Skyrim videos, but I'll go ahead and maybe I'll do a second bit of uh, resource gathering Maybe I'll go through the uh, some of the Markarth quest line. We'll see. Uh, there's a couple things that I still want to do on Skyrim, but keep an eye out on any videos of that. 
And of course, we do have uh, For the King on the channel as well. Uh, videos being posted on uh, most weekdays. Uh, at least when I've got videos prepped. So, uh, anyways. Oh, that reminds me. I need to put tomorrow's uh, on the uh, on the edit. Yes. All right. And like I like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, definitely, if you want to see more uh, castle building content, we'll be. Uh, we'll be here. We'll be Wednesdays here. We'll be doing it or... until it's done, really. Which, we'll see how long it takes, because it's yeah. fifty-three yeah. streams. Then 53 we aren't streams. done yet. To be fair, I don't even know when we started the Conan streams, but it's been a good run. It's been a good run. We still have. Do we have any blank rooms? We've got three in the bottom of the vault tower. We've technically got the We've got first floor map room tower that we at least have a plan for. We have a few. The messenger room is blank. The space above the messenger room is blank. That Ella was thinking of doing some sort of medical. Uh, we have the throne room is currently not done. The war room. The war room and the armory and the, one of the guard posts all on the second floor need to be finished. Uh, well, started and finished. Uh, we have the roof floor, the um, archery range, and the uh, combat uh, arena. There's still quite a bit to do. Still, still a fair bit to do. We will get through it, and it will be a really yep. amazing looking castle by the end. We do have uh, plenty more decorations to throw in. Uh, the guest room needs to be done as well. That, that one's empty. I can do that. Sure. I need to put a couple things in my room, and I need to decide how I'm going to hide the uh, the uh, hidden... Uh, whatchamacallit? The trap door? Trap door. And I need to find a way that I can, you know, get up there. Because I made it kind of awkward with the, with the shelving there. But I'll need to figure that out. for another stream. Yes, it will be. We'll go floor floor by floor, first floor, all the way up to the roof, and then we'll go ahead and do the basement there, uh, including the wine cellar. That'll be a lot of wine and barrels. Lots of wine and barrels. Uh, maybe we'll put some other stuff in there. We'll see what we do. We've got a whole extra room in there. Lots of lots lots of space. Really looking forward to it. Thank you, Evan, for joining us. We shall see you. Next time. Bye. Yeah. Bye-bye, everyone. Farewell.